begins his battle anew, all alone. The treasure lies in the mausoleum. Zero, stage zero. Open the grave. Take the treasure. Take it! Come on, Joy. Come here. It's okay. We'll be fine. <laughs> Day after day with these guys. They don't know when to quit, huh? Yeah. Riku. Shuriken Riku. Kill him. Kill him now! Guess I better get started. Time to thin the herd. has it been? Feels like I've been protecting this mausoleum for a lifetime. battle will end. And when it does, I will. It's okay. I'm not losing this. That's right. I'll win. I have to protect this world. Protect you. So I'll keep fighting for as long as it takes. Then one day, when it's over... Ah! Talking to you, nerd. Better listen. What kind of loser drags a computer to the pool? Uh-huh. What? We were asking if you've seen a pink-haired girl come by. 
Is that clear enough for you? I, I haven't seen her. Hold up. This is that kid everyone's talking about. The one with a dozen jobs. You're the lifeguard, right? Quit farting around. Yeah, actually, I can't really swim, so... I just clean. I have to wait until it closes. Oh, I see. So what would happen if the little one fell in? Don't do it! Better learn to swim and fast! There's no way I could save him. Why'd I jump in? Why? Hey, what happened? Oh. <laughs> Wait! Hey! Cut it out! You're tickling me! Finally! I thought you were dead. So again? Roncho? So, you rescued me? Sadly, no. I got here too late. When I arrived, you'd already been pulled out. Rei Riku saved you. Rei Riku? She's the only daughter of Yuki Riku, vice president of the Godgrave Tech Company. She's got tons of suitors and apparently had a 40-foot container filled with presents for her birthday. She's easily the smartest girl in our school. A perfect princess. Wait a second. Uh, you don't know her? For real? Yeah. <sighs> it wasn't a dream. <laughs> what do I do about this? <laughs> They beautiful sure if you like creepy do we have to be out here i mean there's nobody around that's the point silly no one knows about this spot you're not making sense does this make sense uh, uh, hey uh, what the hell relax no one will find us i'm now close I'm your eyes ready. no don't hey knock it off <laughs> What now? job's pretty great. As long as no pugs come out here, it's super chill. Not to mention, free electricity. I get to relax outside and game as much as I want. All right, time for adventure! Oh, 
Bull. He beat the ultimate dragon with one hit. Look at his equipment. It's just starter gear. Sounds like you noobs need some educating. He's a lone wolf of immense skill who's never uttered a single word. He comes and goes, helping players when they need it most and never asks for anything in return. The amazing Gein! <laughs> ah, no biggie. Oh, sweet, I leveled up again. I mean, I'm nothing special. I just spend every second of my free time playing. Let's see, which dungeon should I hit next? Oh. The heck? Using water-based attacks won't do anything to a kickbacker. For these. You use ice. And hit them hard. I can think of ran out of juice. Yeah. Yeah. Don't worry, Wad Joy, I'll be fine. A little wire work and we're good to go. It was incredible. I mean it. He was so amazing. The boss character was super strong, but he just swooped right in and beat it like it was nothing. Hey. Hey. Them, I'd have freaked out too. Wow, Rick. Oh. You must like that game. You can't put it down. I do, but my father made it, so I might be biased. Makes sense. You're a textbook daddy's girl, Ray Riku. Stop it. But you know, this world is special. Something about it makes me feel like I belong. Whenever I play it, reality fades away. You feel like you belong, huh? Kind of funny considering how much you suck at it. <sighs> Hey, don't be so mean! <laughs> Just kidding, <laughs> Ah, love, how sweet. What the? Rancho? <laughs> don't worry, I'm not judging. It's just... Keep in mind who it is you're falling for. She might as well be an idol to the boys in this school. I'm worried that if you try to reach a star that shines as brightly as she does, the way Icarus did, you'll get burned and fall to your doom. Back off, creeps! Let's go! Hey, <gasps> hold on! Don't run away! Please, Ray Riku! Hey, wait a second. That name, is she the one who... Uh, of course. That jerk, saying whatever he wants. It isn't like that. I just... I don't know. I just... Whatever. At least there's one thing I can take comfort in. Getting stronger in game is all I need. Hey, Gene, how are you? <coughs> I really appreciate you saving me the other day. It meant a lot. Wanna play together? I think it would be fun. I hope to hear from you soon. Oh, <sighs> 
No way. For the next several months, the time she and I spent together seemed like a dream. Being in the game, being with her. I thought that was all I needed. But then... Hey, Dean. What are you like outside of the game? I've been thinking about that for a while now. I'd love to meet the real you someday. What do you think? <laughs> of course, we could never meet. Because in the real world, I'm swamped with part-time jobs. I'm a poor student with no family. We live in completely different worlds. It's true! I'm an awkward nerd. You're a shining star. So... When we're inside the game... Grant me one wish. Let me stay with you. That's all I want. To be here with you forever. I think that would be enough for me. Uh, they're shutting it down for good? The world is ending for good. And so are my adventures with you, Ray. Father, what is this? I want you to hold on to it for a while. If something were to happen, follow the instructions inside it to the letter. Nothing specific, just something? Can you give me a little more than that? Nothing to worry about, dear. Merely a precaution. Dungeon Sentry was nothing but a prototype. It has served its purpose. It's time for my new creation to take its place. This will be the game that truly changes the world. A reality beyond reality. A masterpiece. Beyond reality? Yes. I realize it's poor timing on my part, now that you've found a partner you like. What? Have you been spying on me? Sorry. You're my precious daughter. I was worried about you, that's all. Mm, Daddy, you're the worst! Yes, I know. <laughs> his problem. Hush, he'll hear you. Let's go. I told him he'd crash and burn. Broncho, wait up. What's wrong, Swiggin? I was under the impression that you enjoyed your nightly rendezvous. Yeah, till the world decided to end. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> Come on, man. Just because the game is ending doesn't mean it's over. All you need to do is get closer to her outside of it. I can't. She only knows the me in-game, not the real me. Hold on a second. You love her, but you've never actually met before? Can't be helped. We live in two completely different worlds. I hope he'll be okay. Don't worry, even if the flames consume him. I know he'll rise again from the ashes. That's just the kind of guy Soigen is. 
You're such a great friend to him. <laughs> Work. I need to get to work. I have your schedule, sir. We need to be at the office at 4 p.m. for an executive meeting. After that, President Ling needs to go over the particulars of the new game's announcement with you. Hmm. Ray, go to bed. Staying up late every night is murder for your complexion. I'll be okay. Don't worry. <sighs> well, don't say I didn't warn you. Sweet dreams, Maki. This is bogus. Why didn't they make a public statement about the shutdown? This was so out of the blue. Especially after all the time and money I spent on this game. Seriously. <sighs> on another note, did you hear the rumor? Apparently they added a new rare item. There's only one copy, and if you find it, it'll grant you a wish. You're talking about the evening songflower, right? If we found it, we could wish for the game to continue. Sure, that'll happen. Don't be stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Still, I can't believe it'll be over soon. Guess we'll have to go all out until that happens. Where are you? Come on, Keen. This is one of the last times I'll get to play with you. I hate it, but there's nothing I can do to change it. Okay, you're here now. We only have a week before all of this ends for us. So, until it does... I say we enjoy every adventure this game has to offer. Let's get going. <laughs> I see. As far as she's concerned, this is just one game among countless others. And me, I'm just one of her many gaming buddies. But is that really so bad? Even now, in this game, it's just you and me in this place. I'm able to be with you. Here? They just added a rare variant of the song flower in game. No matter what happens, I want to find it. They call it the evening song flower. Here. Apparently, it grows in one field out of the whole game world. I know we only have a week left to play. But I'd really like to find it if we could. Uh, yes? Are you saying you want to try? You'll find it with me? Together with you. Good evening, world! We at 
at the God Grave Tech Company proudly present our latest creation. The ultimate and massive multiplayer online entertainment. We, we call, call it Grave Buster. In Grave Buster, each player will take on the role of a grave robber. Their goal? To loot the various treasures within each stage. And to help you with this endeavor, we're introducing a new system. Your ultimate strength will be your financial strength. The more players pay, the more powerful their characters will eventually become. Additionally, all players who sign up will receive a specially designed console for free. Seabay, the platform of Grave Buster. Now, get out there and raid some tombs. And aim, aim for, for supreme, supreme financial, financial power. power. There are countless treasures just waiting for you. Only you can dig them up. A reality beyond reality. That, that is, is the essence of Gravebuster. <laughs> Looks like the announcement went off without a hitch, just as we expected. We couldn't have done it without your genius. The name Yuki Riku will forever be synonymous with game design. Hmm. This is only the beginning, my friend. Soon you'll see my vision. Reality beyond reality! Grave Buster! Finally, the day I had dreaded arrived. Dungeon Century would vanish forever. My one way of connecting with her was coming to an end at the stroke of midnight. into our new game, Grave Buster. So don't wait, sign up today. Thank you for your continued support. Mr. Riku, it's getting late. Are you going home soon? Hmm, I wanted to watch over things until the very end. You must really love your work, Mr. Riku. <laughs> Why don't you head on home? No need to worry over me. Yes, sir. Enjoy your evening. I suppose it doesn't matter if I don't find anyone. But I still hold out hope. After all these years, perhaps I should take solace in that. Crap. We were supposed to meet up forever ago. Don't resist me, old man. Playing the thief, huh? How cute. I don't buy it for a second. Shall we drop the act? Fine. I must say, this pains me slightly. Killing co-workers lacks appeal. So this is Ling's move, eh? Not surprising, he never had imagination. Crap, 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 
crap, crap! Help! Please save us! What's wrong? chance. How do we open the tomb? Tell me and I might spare your life. That's not going to happen. Did you honestly think I would help you grave robbers? If I'm to die, it will be with dignity. Said like a true gravekeeper, the last of your kind. Thank you for your years of service, Mr. Riku. <laughs> It's... it's okay. I'm coming. Just wait for me. This game means the world to so many of us! I won't let you destroy it! I need more. I must have all the items. Give them to me. Gein, you're here. I have a message from Ray. Dear Gein, you seem busy, so I'm going ahead to find the flower. I hope you come soon, Ray. and related services will no longer be available. We'd like to thank all of our amazing players for their faithful support.
Juan Choi. Good morning. Yeah, I guess. All this time, I wanted to know the hero behind the mask. And you were right here. I'm glad. You've been helping me for so long now, and at last, I can properly thank you for everything. Thank me? I don't deserve anything like that. You should be furious. When it mattered most, all I could do was watch. I failed you. I couldn't protect you. I'm... I'm pathetic! Well... Uh, huh? I guess that means you'll have to save me the next time around. Uh, After all, there's a new game to play. Of course. I'd be happy to. <laughs> What's up? <gasps> ah, really? You did this to me now? How am I supposed to get to work? Ah, no! Why? <laughs> around the building and several blocks out. No suspects identified yet. We're continuing our investigation at this time. Over. Afraid not. Yuki Riku, vice president of the Godgrave Tech Company, was murdered last night in his office. But he's. Yeah, Rei Riku's father. Oh. No. <laughs> Rei! Sorry, Ray already left. Okay, do you know where she went? Apparently, there's a lot of paperwork for the funeral arrangements. So, people from the company took her. She said she'll be gone for a while. I feel awful for her. She loved her dad more than anything. Poor Ray. Such a tragedy. To think her only living relative would end up like that. I heard he left behind an enormous amount of debt, too. Poor little thing. She's got a tough road ahead of her. My friend Yuki dedicated his life to creating the best games in the world. He sacrificed his own happiness so we could enjoy the fruits of his labor. Even now, I can't believe a light as bright as his was snuffed out so early and so cruelly. Whatever the reason, I can't begin to imagine what he could have done to deserve such an end. I vow that the Godgrave Tech Company will work around the clock with law enforcement to find the culprit of this reprehensible crime and prosecute them to the fullest extent of the law. And to all our loyal fans, I make this solemn promise. We will do everything we can to make sure his final game, Grave Buster, is a worldwide success that can be enjoyed for years to come. <sighs> hey, hold on. Did I know him? Oh. 
sorry for asking you to come here. I'm sure you had better things to do. You're so busy. Oh, please. It's no trouble. At all. Well, uh, I'm so sorry. Thank you. I'm fine now, really. More importantly, there's something very special that I'd like you to have. For me? In the event of my death, please give this to Soigen Riku. It's from your dad? Hold on. Isn't this... Yes, a sea bay. He created this console to play Gravebuster. There's never been anything like it before. Oh. Okay. Why did he want me to have it? User identification commencing. Identification complete. System starting. I'm confused. That makes two of us. <sighs> Wait, I still don't get why he left this for me. Me either. I didn't really know my dad. In fact, I'm not his biological daughter. Uh, but how is that? I was really young, so I don't remember. All I know is he took me in when I was a little girl. We were close, but still he never told me about it. I'm sorry, Soyin. I've made things awkward. No, not at all. It's totally fine. Miss Riku? Yes? Sorry, but you have a guest outside. Oh, Thanks, I'll be right out. Do you mind waiting for a bit? Not at all. <sighs> right this way, miss. Hello! Didn't know Yuki Riku's daughter was such a babe. <laughs> What the? Your current saved wealth is displayed here. Observe. My what now? One, ten, hundred thousand, ten, ten billion? No way. This has got to be some kind of glitch. Mission complete. All the countermeasures are in place. I see. Well done. Unfortunately, he ate a bullet before telling me how to open the tomb. It can't be helped. We'll just have to sort through his estate, piece by piece. There's no need to worry about that. All of his assets have been eliminated and his fake credit has been sent off to collectors. You know how vicious they can be. Such is the fate of all who go against Precious. Death and ruin. That is the will of Dark Tiger. And whatever our master decrees, we will see done without fail. <laughs> I'm sure you're confused, but there's a reason I left this inheritance to you. I want you to use this money to protect my dear Ray and ensure that the two of you live happily ever after. <laughs> Ah! 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 
I didn't think it was possible to be this happy! <laughs> oh, stop, Ray! What would Grandfather think? A second thought, my body is ready! My body is so ready! One more thing. Uh, Ray and I are not biologically related. Her actual mother and father were brutally murdered by the enemy. Her parents were dear friends of mine, comrades with a similar purpose and iron resolve. But the enemy got to them and eliminated them, leaving Ray alone without a guardian. That day, I became her father. I did what I could to raise her and keep her out of harm's way. Grandfather. Stop, please! <laughs> Not our fault. Blame your old man for leaving you this mess. My father would never have left that much debt. Let go of me. Tell us your sob story back at the office. I'm not going anywhere. Stop struggling. Bastards. Soigen, use this inheritance well. Now you are the only one who can protect Ray. Hold it. Huh? Who's this? Let her go. Right now! No, Soigen, stay out of it! Sorry, Ray! No can do! Protect her from the enemy, and create a new future for the both of you. Grass, what the hell is your problem? I'm counting on you. That's My grandson. Make it stop! Please, I'm begging you! I'll go wherever you want. I'll do anything you say, just make him stop! <laughs> now that's the right attitude. Let's go! They get the point. Time's a wasted. Hmm? All right. Damn kid better have learned his lesson. <laughs> Wait. You don't need to take her. I'll pay her debt. You got 500 million? Right. Just wait. You'll see. This time, I will save her. I'm sorry. It is not possible to convert in-game currency into real-world currency. I have all of this money, and it's useless. What's the point if I can't use it when it really matters? <sighs> Again, I'm just completely... Sligan! No, come back! I can't thank you enough for trying! It made me happy beyond words! Please don't forget that! I promise to remember! No matter where we end up, you'll be in my heart! Always and forever! Thank you for being my friend! What a freaking loser. Yeah, but now he's got a taste of the real world thanks to us. We did him a favor. Huh? What's wrong? No freaking way! This kid for real? The hell is he think he's gonna do? Uh, uh, hey, knock it off! Don't you dare! Uh, Ray! Please wait for me, okay? I will, I promise! Wherever you go, I'll follow! I swear I'll save you even if it's the last thing I do! Just wait for me! Oh, of course I'll wait for you! Forever, if that's what it takes! Because I believe in you, okay? Enough of this. <laughs> Eat my grill, loser. <laughs> no, don't! Stay <laughs> out of this! <laughs> <laughs> You 
think he's alive after that? Not our freaking problem. True enough. Ah, who the hell are you? Hey, where'd the poltergeist come from? The name's Silicon Totems. Ray Riku, come with me. What did you do to Ray? Answer me! You must be Sorkin. Temujin sent me with a message. I'll be waiting for you in Grave Buster. Huh? My work here is done. So he gets What now? Would it work? Does it need to charge? I don't see any batteries. My friend, in fact, Yuki, I'm not his biological daughter. Life to creating the best game. I'm also your grandfather. Grandfather. What is Grave Buster? Just a game or something else? Who was that guy? Where'd he take Ray? I'm so lost. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> Where'd you come from? Who are you? You can call me Twin Star Master. Okay. So, is there a reason you're in my bed? You know the answer, Meanie. You called me here, and like any good servant, I do what I'm told. Sorry, but, uh, I think you may have the wrong room, lady. There's no mistake. You're Soigen Riku, <laughs> my one and only master. Buster? It's huge. Uh, what the? So weird. Why did she keep calling me your master? Who is she? Uh, uh, My eyes. I speak, Star. Uh, the hell? I like this stage. Nice and quiet. The sky's so big. I think we've stumbled on some kind of hidden stage. So many tombs ripe for the picking. All right, let the grave robbing begin. Somebody stop the world. I want to get off, twin. Oh, don't touch me there. I'm really sensitive, Star. Guess these weird things are her true identity. Uh. <laughs> oh, 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 Academy, a boarding school filled to the brim with the rich and privileged. But among the celebrity status kids, one was always alone and worked several jobs to get by. Soigen Riku. Gaming is his only talent, and he doesn't pay anything for them. After all, he's broke. Meanwhile, the Madonna of the school is the daughter of world-renowned game designer Yuuki Riku. The beautiful and kind-hearted Rei Riku. She's loaded. Despite sucking at the game, she loves it and plays it every night. Get your beauty sleep, darling. 
One night, while playing her game, a mysterious masked character appears and saves her from a horrific monster. What a hero! Maybe this was destiny, a fated meeting between the two. Sadly, the game was discontinued and they thought they'd never see each other again. Then, on the last day, a strange monster appeared and ruined everything. Talk about heartbreaking. But now there's a new ultimate game called Grave Buster. Like it suggests, it's all about grave robbing. Sounds like there's a ton of secrets to be found in there, huh? Though, who knows if that's true. Now, soygen has been left with an inheritance of 10 billion yen. Lucky guy, but what's the reason? And what's to become of poor Ray? Everything's about to get crazy. Don't you dare miss a minute of the excitement. Long ago, an all-powerful goddess created this world. Then, in order to create life, she selflessly gave up her own. This is how we came to be. With her life force exhausted, the goddess began her eternal slumber in an imperial tomb. Her death left behind a source of unimaginable power. The goddess's name was Bongo. This is the myth of creation that has been passed down through the ages. My ears work fine! Hmm. Quite the attitude. You might be tougher than I thought, boy. Very well. Your work will be tested. We'll see if you can be a Tomb Guardian. This stage has been besieged by intruders. You will help me warn them off and protect the treasures. That will be... Hey! Wait! You disrespectful little brat! Stop! I wasn't done talking! Yeah, that's why I'm leaving. I guess you don't want to save Ray then! How disappointing! <sighs> if you don't pass the test, Soigen, saving Ray will be forever out of your reach. What say you? How'd you know that? Oh, what a shame. You missed. Too far right. Uh, no freaking way. Yes, freaking way. Don't lose your cool, eh, you? Next shot will do it. Try again. Roger that. Adjusting the firing angle. Lock and load. <laughs> We're ready to rock, Phoebes. Five minutes till it's recharged. Far too long. Farin, be a dear and distracted a while, will you? Roger! Great! Just what I needed. Hey, what are you up to, Phoebe? Why, the usual, of course. What else? Here we come. Holy crap! That explosion! What happened? The Tomb Raiders attacked sooner than expected. Tomb Raiders? As I was trying to say earlier, you must fight them with me. That's the only way to prove you are worthy of the moniker. <sighs> Enough. Let's get this over with. Much better. That's what I like to hear. Are you sure you're prepared? <laughs> then let us begin. <laughs> I am Justia. <laughs> the spirit of the desert incarnate.
Excuse me, but would you happen to be young Master Soiken? Oh, uh, yeah, that's my name. <gasps> Finally! I've been waiting for so long! I can't believe you're really here! <laughs> It should all come back to you now. The seal on your memories is broken. I'm so happy for you, I could cry. I remember. My grandpa. This scarf was from him. A gift from long ago. He really was my grandfather. <laughs> so, you finally remember, Sorgan, my boy. That voice. Just who are you? My master! <laughs> Beloved grandson, it's been a while. Looking good, Sorgan. <laughs> what? Look who decided to wake up. <laughs> About time. Who are you? No time, just put these on. Time for purification. Centipede heart, let's go! All right now, you know what to do, babies. Take care of those pesky guardians! You're my gramps? But aren't you... ancient? And dead? I can understand your confusion, my boy, so I'll explain everything. At times, I was the genius game designer. Others, I was the vice president of Godgrave Tech Company. As well as the proud father who raised the beautiful Rei Riku. But my true identity has always been... Your grandfather, the great Yuuki Riku! wondering how I'm here, and it's actually quite simple. This is the data I saved of myself just before I died. <laughs> now do me a favor and call me Gramps again. I love it. Pretty please. Uh, this isn't the time for that. Young no, Master, we need to get inside. <laughs> huh. They're really going at it. Let's hurry up and take care of this. That treasure is waiting for us to find it. And, and get, get our, our hands, hands on, on it, it so, so we can, can make, make our, our dreams come true! <laughs> <laughs> oh, where are we? The cockpit of the Yuuki 34. A guardian giant designed specifically for this hidden level. <laughs> Unbelievable! Finally!
Are you having fun? <laughs> <laughs> Please go more! How disappointing! I thought it would be more of a challenge. Man! Tomb Guardians and Tomb Raiders. These two opposing forces have endlessly fought over the goddess's tomb for a millennium. One side invading, the other protecting. But in the distant past, both sides had the same special powers. How did we ever come to this? This is your mess, twin! Hurry and fix it, Star! Charge complete? <laughs> is to destroy and take the power of the gods for themselves. What is that? It's gigantic! So we, the Guardians, safeguard the power that lies within these sacred sites and the world. This is our eternal duty. Ha! Found him! No need to rush. Aim carefully. You got it. I won't fail you. But over the ages, the number of Tomb Guardians continued to decline. And now... I gotta recharge again. I just shot the thing. Don't be embarrassed. It happens. Could have swore I had it. Huh? Ah! I wouldn't expect any less from a Guardian's cannon. I actually felt that one. They sure know how to keep a girl on her toes. What? Was that too much for you? Man up. Uh, no! It wasn't too much! I just pissed off! Damn it! Now that does it! Let's see how they like it when I bust out my ultimate mode! Then they'll be sorry! They'll see! Yeah. If they want to play dirty, so be it. I have more than one card up my sleeve. <laughs> Shostia? The club! I have to shoot! The club! Here goes! like hypnosis. Not good. Quick! Well, it's down! The armor's been destroyed, twin! And their familiars are crawling inside the giant star! Gramps! Crap, are you okay? One last push should do it. Hey, foreign sweetie. AU's about to release some pent up anger, so you might want to find cover and stay there. Buckle up, fool. 
Please don't go in twin. Must shoot. Club. Grandpa, what's wrong? Come on, talk to me, Gramps. It's fine. I knew my safe data would deteriorate eventually. There's no need to be sad. So I can listen. You must protect Bongo's tomb. If you succeed in this duty, you will save Ray as well. You're the last guardian. I know you can do this. Believe in yourself. Go make me proud. <laughs> I love you. I will, Gramps. I swear it. Pull back. We're done here. <laughs> What? Another player's out there? No, you must be seeing things. I'm not sure. Shoot it! Shoot the club! I have to no matter what! Here goes! One left, and that's me. You attacked the wrong two. <laughs> Damn it! Disappear! What the? I'm counting on you, Soya. Did I pass the test? Yes. Your heroic victory over the Tomb Raiders was proof enough. You are more than worthy of the mantle. Congratulations, young master. Thanks, Justia. But honestly... I just barely pulled it off because the three of you helped me. Mm -mm. Now, young master, you are already a splendid tomb guardian. Thank you for everything you've done. Uh. I wish I could stay by your side. What? Where did... The stage and I have fulfilled our purposes, and now we both must come to an end. <laughs> I know that you'll save her. This is goodbye, young master. Good luck in the battle to come. Boys, my competition? This'll be even easier than I thought. Who are you? Old man Riku picked a widow baby to be the last guardian. Oh, so sad it's almost funny. Listen up, boy, and remember well. You're not the last guardian. That title belongs to me! 
This land may look barren, but it's a place where dreams come true. I have a dream for the future of us gold hunters. A time when ample riches line our pockets. Quit trying to sound cool while you're grabbing my ass. You're not our leader, just a stupid pervert. <laughs> ample riches, so soft. You're not the last guardian. That title belongs to me! I'm known by many names. You can call me Temuji of Totems. I'll be waiting for you in Gravebuster. Till then. Uh, wait, don't hang up yet. Hello? What the hell? Temujin. It's a solid investment. If you get the divine coins, it can multiply 200 times over. Hi there. Got room in your party, big boy? There might be a spot. Then let's go. Uh -huh. Fine then. I'll deposit 500,000. Keep talking like that and I might join you. Doesn't look like our prey wants to come out to play. Well, we're not going after small fry. I wouldn't get enough exercise. I'm beginning to think you're all talk. I might go solo. Calm down, we're about to catch some big quarry. Just a little longer. <sighs> I'll hold you to that. Hey. Hmm? What is it? This is boring. How long are we staying here? Just a little longer. And Gravebuster? Money is the ultimate power. If we've got the dough, the members of Precious will notice us. Then we'll ride the gravy train to Easy Street. Keep that goal in sight, friends. All this waiting will be worth it. Mm -hmm. Over there! Competition. Ah, a fat ducky and some ducklings. All right. Ready? Let's move! Holy... <laughs> We've been ready, darling. Yeah, that much is obvious. New members of Gravebuster must first complete the beginner registration process. If they pass the entrance exam, they're allowed to play. All players that enter must agree to these terms. Read something enough, and the meaning will become clear. You seem hard at work, Soigen. Broncho. Reading up on Gravebuster? Mm-hmm. Well, you're in luck, my friend. How's that exactly? Behold, this beauty is actually a game freak. And she participated in the closed beta. Oh. Nice to meet ya. Ah! Did you see that? Totally one shot at him. <gasps> Guess that 200,000 is already paying off. So cool! Money is power, and we've got loads of it. <laughs> oh my, are you a warrior? Oh. That's right. 
In that case, handsome, would you mind doing me a favor? I'd be sure to reward you. Just, Just name it. it! Wait a second! Doesn't this seem suspicious? <laughs> We just found them. Big, bountiful mounds of amazing treasure. Sadly, there are tentacled monsters guarding it, and I'm so afraid they're going to get me. This buxom babe. And tentacles? No! <laughs> Don't be shy, Far, and ask for their help. Please, help us. She's a super cutie too, oh boy! That slightly called the meaners eating me up! Great, the treasure's this way, boys. Okay! Hey, don't leave without me! Wait! Currently, the ruler of Grave Buster is someone called Dark Tiger. He heads an organization known simply as Precious. Precious has an enormous amount of wealth, which it uses to control the game world, all the while stealing the money and items of other players and gaining even more power. But lately, there are forces fighting against them. Tamajin of Totems? You're getting into some dangerous territory. Uh... Totems is a powerful new group. They're challenging Precious for supremacy in Gravebuster. Tamajin's their leader and a total villain who will do anything to win. He's known as a terrifying devourer and he'll take whatever he wants. Whatever he wants? <laughs> Terrifying devourer? <sighs> Devour her? <sighs> ah! Rain, no! Hello? How do you like my home? By all means, make yourself comfortable. If you need something, say the word. I'll make sure that you get it. I need to be set free! Guess I should have seen that one coming, huh? <sighs> Give it time. Enough of my hospitality, and you'll be begging to stay here forever. <laughs> Feisty, aren't you? Fine by me. It wouldn't be fun if you gave in quickly. <laughs> Just looks like more rocks to me. Maybe they took off after they saw our epic gear. Guess we're done here. Oh! No, we're still in danger. The monsters are in that abandoned mine. Those creepy things slimed all over us. We barely escaped with our lives. Yeah, right. Before we got away, they took over three million from us. What? Three million? <laughs> I'm known far and wide as the Golden Ryozaburo, but you can call me... Gah! <laughs> Gah! Wow. 
wild wolf. That's Monday! I left her desk the way it was. I thought that would make her happy whenever she came home. Of course, after those men came, she just vanished. I'm holding out hope that she'll be back, but... Don't worry. Everything will be okay. Ray will come home. Count on it. How do you know that? Because I'll bring her back. No matter what I have to do. Nothing beats a tall, cold one after a hard day's work. That was awesome! We wouldn't be the gold hunters without you, bro. I know, I know. And then again, those noobs were total morons. True, but we raked in a tasty million because of them. And that, my friends, is why it's always best to swipe from the dumb and the loaded. Uh, yeah, you probably shouldn't go around saying that in public. Uh, why not, babe? Forget about it. Hey. <laughs> Does that guy seem weird to you? Uh, I'll go ask him what's up. I'm sorry you had to wait, my lord. It's ready then? Yes, finally. Well done, Retretta. I'm pleased. My lord. Precious will never see this coming. I'm looking forward to the results. No! You made it for her? For that stupid woman? Stand down, Koshiriko. Now that you, Hiriko, is dead, she's useless to you! She's just a bimbo with no power! So why? Tell me. She still has worth, even if you don't understand it. Be patient, girl. You will soon see. But Temujin... <laughs> they were wiped out? Yeah. That's what he said anyway. Back up a bit. We're talking about THE generals, right? But they were the backbone of Precious. Each of them was filthy rich. You're saying he was their leader? He looks poor as dirt. I know. But apparently... Some insanely strong woman showed up, stripped him of all their rare items and cash, then left him to rot. Poor guy just drank away his last gold piece. A chick did that? One person against all of them? Yeah. I call Bull. He's probably just in fighting or something. Besides, their leader should be someone awesome looking. Like me. Another day, another newbie to mug. Now, drop your belongings. Or you'll see this sword up close. <gasps> no! Mercy, please! We'll pay whatever you ask. Just don't kill us! <laughs> You're not as dumb as you look. Tell you what, I feel generous, so here's a tip. In Grave Buster, money is life. So get all that you can. Being broke is a death sentence. A bare wallet means a full coffin and your account will get the axe. Bro's a bona fide wordsmith. <laughs> that was so lame. He's a bona fide something, all right. Your account will get the axe. Awesome. <laughs> we got a winner. <laughs> How about that? Financial power went over 50 million! Oh, 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 no, no, no! Oh, my items! <laughs> now let's see how much you have. <laughs> All right, who's dying? You are. But before you do, you're gonna let me get a good look at that sword of yours. Uh, 
that a flirt? <laughs> That's far enough. He's a loudmouth bozo, but he is our leader and we will protect him. Well done, guys. I'm so proud. Drop it, honey. Nice and easy. over the goods, honey. <laughs> now, hold on. Let's talk about this. Spare me and I'll hand over all of my friend's buster items. The electron sword, free slants, and quartet marker rare. <laughs> For real? Totally called it. Pathetic. Did I say rare? I meant they're super rare. Come on, it's not a bad deal, right? Oh, wait, I know. They have that. Yeah, you know, that one thing really valuable? They try to keep it a secret from everyone, even me. You should take it. <laughs> That's right. Like that. Oh, bro. This is weirdly refreshing. He's seriously trash. The sword drains an opponent's financial power? Useful. <clears throat> However, it looks like there's a catch. Regardless of who's on the pointy end, it drains whoever has less money. Sucks to be you, then. I got around 50 million. Now let's see how much cash you're holding. What the hell? <laughs> you gotta be kidding me! Only five players in the world have that much money! Just look at it! <laughs> You're a billion player! I don't mind giving you a taste. <laughs> if you think you're man enough to handle it. Take it you're ready, Master. I know where I need to go. That was too close for comfort. If we hadn't been in this barrier... Where's Bro? Uh, Bro? Are you dead? Yell if you're dead! It's her. Hey, psycho bitch! You could at least give us your name. My name is the Collector. You Tomb Raiders are an eyesore. One day I'll wipe you from the face of this world! <laughs> <laughs> the collector. Bro, wake up! Come on, man! Stay with me, you'll be alright! Money is gone! Bro, no! <laughs> We have the name of the one who defies us. She goes by the moniker, Collector. Those who stand against Precious will pay with their life.
days has it been? Feels like forever. I don't know. Takashi, you've been staring at that console an awful lot. Oh, sorry. It's just, if I make enough money in this game, maybe I could get out of this town someday. <laughs> if you did, where would you go? Wherever I could, it'd be heaven compared to this. Sounds great. I'd like to go. Well, I wouldn't mind taking you with me, Nikon. We could go anywhere. Together. You're sweet. That means a lot. Thanks. <sighs> Quit gawking, bimbo. Move it. The lovely Ray Riku. We welcome you as a member of Totems. As a token of your initiation, we present you with this red console. May it bring you fortune. That has absolutely nothing to do with it. I can't let you in until you've paid the 50,000 entry fee. 50,000? Ball's in your court, kid. Fine. If you can't pay the damn fee, don't fuss, brat. Better not see you. Pardon me, <laughs> sir. Could I get a flyer? Of course. Take two if you like. Hey, you wouldn't happen to know where Lao Long the matchmaker is, would ya? Oh. <laughs> I might know. I came here to see a fight! Hurry up, would ya? I'm Soigen, by the way. Who are you? I'm Takashi. And you can call me Pack Mule. My arms feel like noodles. Why are we watching from up here? I didn't come here to watch the tournament, remember? I just want to meet Lao Long, so it was pointless to pay for a ticket. 50,000 isn't chump change, you know. Did you forget you're a billion player, or are you trying to hide that fact for some reason? I'm just used to being frugal. So what's your business here, Takashi? I'm here to fight and win this thing. But I figured it was smarter to wait and size up the competition instead of going in guns blazing. Hey, over there! It's Lao Long! That's him on the right. He's in charge of all beginners courses in Gravebuster. Let's talk to him. Let's slow our roll first. Ladies and gentlemen, kids of all ages, thank you for your patience. What do you say we get this final match underway? He's a self-proclaimed best ice user in the land from the stormy seas, Mammoth Viking. And his opponent, the number one ice user, Frost Magician, A.U. The best versus number one, how exciting. At least we know their egos are on the same level. This is it, folks. The winner of this icy bout will walk away with 10 million in cold hard cash. With an added bonus of this adorable ice snow leopard companion. 10 million? What a prize. All right, ice users, let's heat this place up. Ready, go! You might as well give up, little man. Those prizes belong to me. <laughs> Was that an attack? Or a tickle, old man? You think this could stop me? Damn, guess that didn't work. Looks like Mammoth has gone animalistic on the poor Frost Magician. But he's cool under pressure. Look at his face! Keep coming. Every step you take brings you closer to your doom. <laughs> I'll be sure to make it quick. No. What are you doing? 
Definitely planning something. Huh? You can tell? Who do you think's gonna win, Takashi? Neither one. They don't deserve it. Huh? The ten million in prizes belongs to me! <laughs> End of a line, Gramps. Uh -huh. I don't believe my eyes! It's raining men! That hurt. I'm your opponent now. Let's do this. Judges, what's he on about? Let's see. According to the rule book, if an intruder happens to defeat one of the original participants, they have the right to fight in their place. Sounds crazy, but this is totally illegal. Works for me. <laughs> All right, I'll just get these intruders' IDs in the system. Takashi and Soigen Riku are now designated as the challenging team for the final match. Uh, uh <laughs> who the hell thought up that rule? Sorry to get you caught up in this, Soigen, but no matter what, I have to win that 10 million or this was all just for nothing. <laughs> Ever since we were little, we were always together. Me and Mikan. Here, that's your share, Takashi. All we have to do is use these and we can make money, right? <laughs> Only if you win, silly. I will! You'll see! <laughs> can't keep running from every monster. The only way to get stronger is to beat them. Nah, -uh, there's other ways. This paladin's memoir lets you increase your fighting power even if you don't fight anything. Sounds fishy if you ask me. It's true, it works, just look. <laughs> if you put a photograph in, you get stronger little by little, but you have to do it daily for it to add up. Oh. Uh -uh. At least now I know the reason you've been sneaking photos of me whenever you got the chance. No, not just of you. Right, I believe that. Fess up, I'm on to your candid antics. Uh, sorry, it's just that I'm always with you. You're the only person I can take pictures of. Let me see. Uh. Come on. Oh my. Are you angry? Of course not. Why would I be mad? Uh, These memories are precious. We should cherish them together. Uh, and you're just as precious to me. After all, we're partners, Takashi. <gasps> Mikan, no! You'll get better. I'll make sure you do. I'll get you out of here and into a better hospital. I'll go make some money. Just hold on till then. <laughs> you dummy. Don't worry about me. Just get out of this town for both of us. Hold on a little longer. I'll win, and we'll leave that place together. Takashi, that book. <laughs> it doesn't matter if there's two or ten of you. You won't beat me! And why is that? Intruders who qualify to fight will have to take a major penalty. What did he say? Regardless of personal circumstances, intruders will have the strength of all their abilities cut in half! <laughs> you see? You screwed yourself. There's no way you'll be a match for me with that puny amount of power. But I didn't know that. You barged in without checking all the rules first? Talk about doing something rash. I don't care! I'm still winning that 10 million! <clears throat> This! Apparently, Takashi's item converts photographs into raw fighting power! Indeed! But with every attack, the memories contained within the photographs burn away! That's a hefty sacrifice! He loses his memories? I'll lose everything I cherish if that's what it takes! I'm saving Mikan! Nothing you do will stop me! She from the Intruders team rushes at Viking with reckless abandon! Uh, this is for me, Well, this is an unexpected turn of events! 
For some reason, the intruder team has started attacking each other. What'll happen next? Could this be some sort of strategy? Uh, I haven't the slightest. But speaking of the intruders, I think I've seen that girl before. Viking, Viking, he's our man. Now it looks like Mammoth Viking is having a performance battle with the intruder team's mascot girl. I don't know what to expect anymore. I don't know what's going on, but it's funny. <laughs> My, you're such a big, handsome man. Thankfully, this guy's brain is in his biceps. I'm counting on you, Sorgan. Why did you stop me? Uh, the pictures disappeared. And they'll never come back. Do you honestly think Mikan would be happy about this? <gasps> they weren't just yours. They were a part of her, too. Of her heart. These memories were precious reminders of your time together. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just... There's no other way to cure Mikan's illness. I have to win that money. Do you think I want this? I want to keep our memories, but if I do, I'll lose her instead. What do I do? Take it. Thanks, Soigen. But I... I can't use it. You won't have to. Hang back. Let me handle the rest. Looks like the intruder teams finished their little spat. The hammer kid is out, and the red scarf is in. This is one wild final. According to the system, Red Scarf is Soigen Riku. Well, this is unexpected. He hasn't even finished the beginner's course. Our new finalist is a complete amateur, ladies and gents. I know him from before. Uh-huh. I think I'm being insulted. You make me wait, and now you want me to fight this loser? I'll rip his face asunder. Come on. You don't give it everything you've got. You don't stand up, Sam's in hell! Newcomer Soigen is no match for Mammoth Viking's overwhelming power! I believe in you! Uh, really? This kid's hopeless. So quit dodging and fight me! You're making it too easy, noob! Soigen's in real trouble now thanks to Viking's ice attack! He's struggling with all his might, but he just can't budge! This doesn't look good for Red Scarf. Viking moves in for the kill! That's what you get for mocking me! <laughs> no! Well, kid, I snow with ya! <laughs> Holy crap! What an upset! The mascot girl from the intruder team has just jumped into the fray! This finals match is getting crazier every minute! <sighs> Strange. There's no registration data on her. Then, could this girl be... Whew! Thanks, Twinstar, that was close. You're gonna owe me big time for this later. You've got strength, style, and curves in all the right places, lady. You'd be the perfect wife for the mammoth Viking! A wife? Really? Well, you're right about everything else. But I doubt you'll want to tie the knot. Once you've seen the terror of my true form. True form? You gonna let me see the real goods or something? That was it, huh? How is that scary? We chose the wrong form, twin! <gasps> That's not wrong, it's adorable! I can't believe how soft you are! Like a couple of marshmallows! Oh. <laughs> bounce, bounce! I don't know which one of you I like better! Ew, this guy's a freak! Oh. Let them go! <sighs> What'd you do that for, brat? Takashi? Guys should treat girls with respect. 
Sorry, Soigen, but I can't let you fight my battles for me. Okay, the monsters are gone now. Takashi, what's the matter? You aren't hurt, are you? Come on, talk to me. I'm here, so there's nothing to be scared of. You got guts, kid. I like that. <laughs> now you got to the count of three till I pummel your face in! Three! <laughs> I wanted to be a hero! To protect me, God, forever! I won't run from you! I won't hide like a coward anymore! Whatever happens, I'm going to protect her! Takashi. Despite his size, Viking is a pretty small man. He's beating the little boy without any remorse or honor. <laughs> You're really brave, Takashi. Thanks for protecting me. Mikan's a lucky girl. You can let go now. Huh? Aha! I had a feeling about that young lady. Her ability to change form at will means only one thing. She isn't a player at all. She's a gray beast! <gasps> Please tell me you're joking, sir! A humanoid gray beast is one of the highest level familiars in all of Grave Buster! Who in the world is this young man? He's so amateur it hurts! Yet he controls a familiar? Ridiculous! Kinda. <laughs> CB? Uh-huh. Don't think I'm intimidated by your little transformation act, girly! I know you're trying to mess with me, and I'm calling your bluff. Bring it! <laughs> you asked for it. The legendary twin headed J Dragon! I'm sure of it! Why is it serving that amateur? <gasps> what the hell's going on? This isn't sexy or cute! Okay? Take care of Soigen, okay, Dragon Lady? And thanks again! Dragon Lady's got a ring to it. Uh, oh, right. Hey, Soigen. Are you sure about this? That was an awful lot of money you gave up. I'm a billion player. I can go without. Ten million's a proverbial drop in the bucket. More importantly, could you put some clothes on? Uh until I recharge the energy I use saving your sorry butt! All that real money wasted! Hmm? Whatever! Uh, real? I, I had no idea! Any idea who that guy could have been, Mr. Lao Long? Who knows? The fact that he has a grave beast in tow might be a clue to answering it. You don't think he's the Collector's? Shh, careful! You shouldn't say her name out loud! That witch conquered this stage without any resistance. If she got wind of this... Well... Let's just say Calamity would be the least of our worries. Are you two here for the beginner's course? Is this the right spot? <laughs> Me? I'm in the same boat. The name's Soigen Riku. I mean, you guys are trainees, right? I'm looking forward to working with you, you know, seeing as we're all newbies here. 
<sighs> Wait up. I know you. Uh, Soigen. You're Soigen. Jeez, man, why didn't you say anything? Yeah. You're that destitute student who works all the time and has no social life. Thanks. Incredible. I never imagined I'd run into you in Crave, Buster. Luck, I guess. <laughs> nice to, um, who are you? Oh, come on. You know me, Shaw. You and I are in the same class together. Though I totally see why you'd forget. You are always sleeping in there, after all. <laughs> Kidding aside, you didn't forget your student council president, right? No, Shaw! Student council president! Good to see you again! Hey, why don't you two save the gab fest for your own time? Uh, 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 no hard feelings. How about you and I break the ice here, stranger? After all, the three of us will be working together as a team. I'd rather not. Uh. Uh. You must be the new trainees, Titan. <laughs> Are you Shaw? Uh, yes, ma'am! You must be Soigen Riku. Yep, that's me. I'll be serving as your instructor for the beginner's course today. You may call me Rin. Your lesson takes place here and involves an actual battle. What you see are the remnants of a looted tomb. Hundreds of years ago, grave robbers defeated the resident boss, took the treasure, and left it a desolate valley. Warriors dreamt of this place. Now, only a wasteland remains. What are those things? You must mean the tunnel apes. Welcome to your first challenge of the day. They may not look like much, but they're surprisingly fast and vicious. So then we just have to defeat them all? Sounds easy, huh? Working together, we can take them without any problem. Right, guys? Can we start this mission, or are we just gonna talk them to death? <laughs> Funny. Do you think they're waiting on me to say go? <sighs> When each of you join the game, you received a unique weapon. This is your buster item. You need to break them out if you want to pass this challenge. You talking about my storm eye here? I've got my metal fist. Whoa, those are awesome. What are you waiting for, Soigen? Let's oh. see your buster item. I've got one, only... I really wouldn't call it special or anything. Attack! <laughs> I thought. No effect. What the hell are we supposed to do when physical attacks won't work? Good question. Now what? There's no chance we're going to break through their armor this way. New plan. We need to defeat the Elder. The what? That three-eyed giant, 12 o'clock. The Grand Tunnel Ape, leader over the Horde. As long as he's around, the enemy's defenses are raised. Which means we gotta take him up first. No sweat. Right, team? Oh, amazing! Just did. I feel like I've seen it somewhere before. <laughs> well, that didn't go the way I expected it to, but hey, these chunks can still produce change. First things first, don't push through these apes with a triple combo! And then to level up! <laughs> oh, she's so beautiful. That woman is no mere teacher. <sighs> she's an idol you'd see once a millennium! I am your humble servant, Princess Rin, serving under your foot till my dying breath! 
My heartbeat feels like it's going a million miles an hour! Oh god, what a total rush! Soon? Here? Shah? Hmm? Anyone see Shah today? Well, uh, now that you mention it... I guess he's absent. I didn't even notice he was missing. Yeah, he doesn't exactly stand out. <laughs> That proved quite the haul. <laughs> so I'm guessing that concludes the beginner's course, right? What? Already? We just got started. Come on, don't you want to order me around anymore, Princess Rin? Actually, things aren't wrapped up here quite yet. There is one final objective left before you complete this stage. The three of you versus me. If you want to move on, then you have to win! Seaweed, go! <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> Based off your reflexive reactions, I was able to measure the extent of your abilities. ID Titan. You managed to quickly summon a familiar without even using your buster item. A cautious choice based off your assumption my kunai might have carried some additional effect. Too cautious, though. In the end, it was merely a physical attack. Huh. You have a familiar? Crap, Titan, just how much money did you sink into this game? I've invested about 500,000 myself, but there's no way I could afford a familiar. Wait, I'm guessing you must have defeated some high-level monsters and been saving for a while now. Since you're always working, it must be difficult spending time on a game, right, Soygen? Huh? But don't worry. My family's rich, so I'll pour even more money into the game and protect you. And afterwards, <laughs> we can team up. What do you say, partners? Shut up! Yes, ma'am! ID Shaw, I suggest you remove that kunai from your forehead. Hold on. A kunai? In my head? Oh. Ah! There's a kunai in my forehead! Get it out! Stop screaming! Ah! Here I thought you were eager to follow my every order. I am, but removing it sounds super painful! Stop wasting time! Right away! Anything for you, Rin. Shaw! There's no need to worry. Oh. That wound is barely more than a scratch. He's overreacting, big surprise. <sighs> now then, as for you, Soygen, if you underestimate me again, you'll end up getting hurt. What, me? I would never underestimate you. <laughs> for real, I swear I wouldn't. I can see right through you. I must say that item is rather unique. Is that her ability? Seeing what other players have equipped? Enough delaying! Show me your buster item right now, Soygen! Nah, it's not a big deal, really. Nothing to get excited over. I'm not buying into your humble act. <laughs> That's one way to get my attention! My apologies, but I do hate wasting my time. Hey, you were the one who told us that we need to defeat you before we can pass this starter course. Well, Instructor Ren, I intend to. I guess I did say that, didn't I? Fine, then. Why don't we conclude your first lesson, Trainee Titan, whenever you're ready. That's strange. I seem to have misplaced my textbook. I hope that won't be a problem. I'm afraid it is. You see, I don't get paid for overtime. I've definitely seen those maneuvers before. I remember! He entered the three biggest virtual fighting game tournaments and won each of them back to back three years in a row! I can't believe it's actually him! He's the Titan, the legendary gamer! Wait, he's a virtual fighting champion? You bet! He wrecks everyone with his incredible power, speed, and technique. The undefeated Crusher Titan. Not a doubt in my mind. But for some reason, he didn't enter the tournament this year. Not only that, look all over the internet. You won't find any history on him. Titan conquers again! The man's a living legend! With three titles in a row, he's truly the best in the world! He has no equal in this or the virtual world! Young Master, in honor of your victory, your father has sent you a congratulatory present. Please accept this reward. Uh, 
Father, what's this? It's Gravebuster. This will be our new goal. Uh, but that wasn't the deal! You wanted to make me proud, right? Or am I mistaken? No, you're correct. Why isn't the rest of my team helping me? I could have sworn someone said we're all in this together! We can't get to the next stage unless you help me defeat her! Don't take me lightly! Even if there were ten more of you, I could win this in my sleep! After all these long, fruitless years of searching, finally, I found my one true love, and now I have to defeat her? Oh, fate is so cruel! I can't get the girl in real life or the game! You know what? Screw this reality! There's no way I can fight her! Then again, if I defeated her, it'll prove I'm loyal, since she did order me to take her down. Yes, I will fight for you! And then Rin and I will view the Terracotta army hand in hand! Shaw, you okay? Never better! Come, Soigen! To the battlefield, where I'll profess my love to her! Your warrior is coming, oh, my Oh, my sweet. goodness. Ravenscar, go! <laughs> Item number zero one. First blood, engage! Shoot, this skill allows you to learn the ability of the first combatant that's defeated in battle. Seeing how no one's actually fallen yet, maybe I should have waited before summoning it. Over here, Soigen! Uh, Behold the power of love! Try and keep your eye on my Stormite special ability if you can! Here one minute and gone the next! He vanished? Nope, guess again! I'm right beside you! Uh, huh? Wait, you're transparent. Yeah, and just wait until you hear my brilliant idea. I have the special ability to become one with the wind, which means I can get close to Rin and whisper my email address into her ear. If you'll excuse me, I've got a date with destiny. Princess Rin, you've given me wings to soar. This is Shaw, headed your way. Oh, I'm sure she can hear you coming. Do me a favor and just die. Oh, crap. Now, Seaweed, go find out how many hit points she has left on her. Beginning stat analysis. Remaining HP is at 15%, or more precisely. Oh, so you're a pervert. I didn't say that you could film me. Think you're pretty funny, huh? It's a real shame. You were so strong, too. <laughs> Unfortunately, ID Titan, I'm afraid I can't allow you to pass the beginner's course. All right, Princess Rin, here I come. Please accept my email request. And you're out. No, Shaw! I'm sorry. I failed you guys. But then again, it's not exactly a surprise someone without any talent or strength wasn't meant to play Grave Buster, right? That isn't true. I know if you keep trying, you'll get there. You think one day I could be on the same level as you guys? Strong as you, Titan, or Rin? Yeah, I guarantee it. Thanks. That means a lot to me, Sorgan. And maybe after I grow stronger, Princess Rin will let me become her line friend, too. I do have one regret. What is it? It's just... in the end... I was kind of hoping to use Rin's lap as a pillow. <laughs> I understand. This fight is over. Continuing is pointless. Huh? I mean, come on, Titan. Neither of us can defeat her. You're giving up? It's not that. She's invincible. Feeling any better, Shaw, sweetie? I have warm soup waiting for you outside the door if you want any to eat. Aren't you feeling hungry? Great news, Mom! Look here! I just made a new friend online! <gasps> what are you talking about? Did your cold get even worse? I'm fine! In fact, I've never felt better in my entire life than at this very moment! The guy's poor, not like me, so he's working all the time. He also goes to the same school and sleeps in class all the time, but he's really good at games! The only one who's invincible here is me! 
Or did you somehow forget that I'm an undefeated champ? No way in hell I can let you go beyond this stage. Give it a rest. You haven't even seen my full routine yet. Let's see. Given the strength of the signal, they should be somewhere around here. Hey, that looks promising. I admit you're a perfectly qualified fighter. But behind all that skill and ambition, I sense something poisonous lurking in your heart. I can't in good conscience let you through. Because I feel something awful would happen. My only choice is to prevent you from continuing further in the game. So you're Instructor Rin. <laughs> if this counts as defeating you, then I pass, right? Cool. Soigen! But how'd you figure it out? What? You mean your Shadow Clone? It was when you stabbed Shaw, right in the heart. There was no way you would have that much accuracy with peripheral vision alone. Which meant you had a vantage point from another angle. Or even a different location. Yeah, yeah. What, you want a prize? There's no way. It was an illusion? I was wasting my time on this thing? Damn it! I'm the three-time virtual fighting world champion. And all along I was boxing with a shadow? <laughs> Prove you're not a disappointment, that you're the best in the world, and worthy of my praise. What are you staring at? A decoy mirage. Pretty clever, I gotta admit. It allows the user to project their image and even alter it some if they want to. Huh. To think the instructor's identity was a mere child. Beginner's course now completed. Welcome to the world of Grave Buster. Those who pass the training level now have the ability to use the ally card. Okay, what's this ally card do? What do you think? If two players possess one, you can use your C-Base to read each other's info and have the option to create a party. So the short version is we can form teams now. You're getting ahead of yourself. It's about time that you were honest with me. <laughs> I have a hard time believing you're a novice. Maybe when the time's right. Oh, it's right. Cause I wanna know too. <laughs> Just how strong are you, Soigen? <laughs> you want Titan the level's over! <laughs> you're wrong. It's not over until all opponents are defeated! Enough, Titan! <laughs> I'm gonna clear this tutorial 100%. And that includes you, Soigen! Let's go! He's gone insane! <sighs> okay. <sighs> I think we should be able to buy some time in here. Pretty impressive. Uh, Looks like you didn't take any damage. Not a scratch. <laughs> you all right? Call me Farin. So, Farin, why weren't you fighting back? Because of my decoy mirage. It takes some time to recharge after using it. You want to tell me why you went out of your way to save me? I want you and I to form a party. No offense, but you're not exactly my type, Soigen. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> Twin Star! Uh, I'm a little busy. With what? You cleared the stage. Everything's wrapped up, so there's no reason to stay. You don't expect me to leave her here with Titan? Oh, <laughs> you're so chivalrous when it comes to young ladies, uh. man. How about you and I reach an agreement, Farin? If I'm able to defeat Titan for you, you come with me and join my party. You're kidding. Nope, we can pinky swear on it. We have a deal? Time to finish this. You're about to find out who's the strongest one here, and it'll hardly be a competition. Summon First Blood. It allows me to wield a technique from the first person to die in a stage.
conjure man of the wind. The ability that weirdo was using? <laughs> what good is stealing a technique from someone who lost? You'll see soon enough. I doubt it. It didn't save him and it won't save you! Ugh! Over here, Titan! Dumber than Shaw. Did he really expect to damage me using such a weak attack? You probably think you've got the upper hand here, but I know where you are. Right there! Titan! Zoygen! Whoa, what the hell? Heads up! Cancelled Man of the Wind since I no longer needed it. So that breeze I was fighting. Only a gust of wind. That was nothing more than an illusion you were chasing around. An illusion? Don't play games with me! Had enough, Titan? Do yourself a favor and surrender already. <laughs> <laughs> you expect me to concede to someone like you? Huh. Don't you know I'm one of the chosen elite, Soygen? There's nothing I can't do. I couldn't lose even if I was trying to. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's give a huge round of applause to our winner, the incomparable Titan! Dude takes this game serious, huh? Not only that, based on what I've heard, the guy's dad is super loaded. Have you heard the rumor? They say he may have rigged the entire match. Hey, say that to my face. Come up here and try fighting me, you poor bastards. What did you say to us, rich boy? Who the hell do you think you are? You're all beneath me. Bring it! Uh, uh, let go of me! It's taken care of, young master. I paid those boys three million each to keep their mouths shut. I also had them sign non-disclosure agreements as a safety precaution in case they went to the press. I don't see the point since they started the fight. You're the future of this family and we have to protect you. Yeah, sure, preserve the family legacy. Which means I can't do anything. That's not true. Well, if that's the case, guess I'll do whatever I want. After all, there's no problem in this world that can't disappear with money. <laughs> the way I see it, this game's no different. I'm rich, so there's no way I can lose! It's changing shape! Behold, the Blade of Tybotan. Marvel at the ultimate form of my buster item. Oh, oh perfect. perfect. Ever since we first announced Grave Buster, at present over 10 million users have started playing. Thanks to the various in-game purchases and high-leveled equipment, the game's popularity is growing faster than we ever expected. A multitude of bosses across several stages have been defeated, and players have started muscling in, taking over levels. And this is the final step of our plan. This is how we get past zero. Now then, members of Precious, shall we take our leave? In this battle that has raged for a thousand years, Precious has been the predominant figure among the grave robbers. Their leader, a mysterious user known only as Dark Tiger, is a billion player of which there are only five in existence. This Dark Tiger is accompanied by an echelon of 16 elite members. Their combined assets are rumored to exceed over two billion. Ah, it's good to be home. Good news, Dark Tiger. I'm pleased to report we're ready to conquer Zero. 
We are at your command and will carry out any order that you see fit. Tell me, how are the preparations for the festival on stage 18 tomorrow? I've taken the liberty of already emailing the transfer rings to the players. This will ward off and ensure the defeat of weaker elements in the game. However, I fear there is still one cause for concern. Which is? We were certain we had disposed of all the Tomb Guardians. Yet, just a moment ago, the number on the scale increased from zero to displaying a one instead. Mm hmm Which means we gotta worry about some new Guardian wandering around. How would you like us to proceed with this anomaly, Dark Tiger? It doesn't matter their identity. Destroy them. <laughs> Dad, I hope you're watching. I'm strong. Strong and ruthless. I am the chosen one. With more money than I even know what to do with. So how about I spend a hundred million? Kill them both in the blink of an eye. Charge complete! You two are about to be roadkill! <laughs> It'll be fine. I'm here, Farin. What? Are you out of your mind? If he really wants to kill us, he'll have to run me over first. Don't do this, Soigen. I know how you work all the time just to make ends meet. Whatever you put in the game, it's no match for him. You damn casual player! You don't belong in this game! You do remember we made a promise. If I defeat Titan, then the two of us could be on a team. <laughs> But how? Even after I charged a hundred million into that last attack! He's a nobody! There's no way this part-time player could have more money! Could be richer than Titan! You beat him like he was nothing! Exactly how much do you have invested in this game, huh? I can't disclose that information, but Titan's assets are zeroed out. Pretty sure he's finished. Poor guy. That's great and all, but I think you're forgetting about what happens next. We're, We're in trouble! trouble. The item's gonna detonate! And the more money you spent on it, the bigger the explosion! Hey, do me a favor and get off me. Yeah... So, all that's left is for us to log out, right? If I could reach my sea bay... <laughs> Mine's out of reach as well. Someone will eventually come save us. What do you mean, eventually? How can you be so casual? <laughs> Try anything and they're only gonna find one survivor! <laughs> oh, uh, before we log off, I wanted to know, you have some kind of ability to analyze your opponent's buster item. You used it on me, right? And if I did, what's the big deal? It's not. I just think it's pretty cool. Huh? I know you've got a bunch of other friends, Farin, but I really would love for you to be on my team. Hold on, this is all moving so quickly. Do me a favor and just think about it. I'll put my address in your sea bay. Let me know what you decide. Sorry, I've got too many people in my address book. That's okay. No big deal. seen a carriage like that be careful I'm detecting an intense amount of pressure coming from inside <laughs> hello darlings Farin we did complete the beginners course right there were no tasks left uh, yeah then what's this doing here I finally found you to think of all places, you'd be in a beginner's course flirting with a lolly. Not what I expected, Sorgen Riku. She just called you by your full name. Do you know her? Nope, but 
but I'm curious to find out who she is. Where do you think you're going? Hold on a minute! Sorgen! It's fine. Still, why are you so worried about me all of a sudden? Because she's not an ordinary player. In fact, when I used my probing eye to uncover more info, there wasn't any data. What I do know is someone with a Divine Tomb weapon will give off a flame like Aura. Players should only be able to have one Divine Tomb item each. But when I look at her, I don't see a player with a single flame. She's got a total of ten surrounding her. I heard there's a sole individual who has this ability. One of the billion players. She's called the Collector. You see a lot, Missy. That's quite an extraordinary gift you possess. She's a billion player? What's someone like that doing here? One downside to having such an ability, too much knowledge, can be dangerous. for concern the girl will be fine you turned her into a doll what do you think happens when people get shot with plushy bullets it won't cause damage she will however remain unconscious for the next couple of minutes just long enough to give the two of us some alone time the hell is your problem lady well ah! i'm glad you accepted my present i went through a lot of trouble choosing it especially for you but please be kind you might not like it at first but i know in time it'll grow on you what did I get shot with? It stuck on my face. Oh, uh, uh, what the hell is this thing? And why isn't it letting go of my head? Uh. Oh, I would have thought you'd be more appreciative of such a thoughtful gift. I mean, take a look at how anxious the little guy is to become one with you. Become one? Don't tell me it's... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Disgusting! It went down my throat! What'd you do to me? That little scamp is called a sausage dragon. It's a grave beast with a fondness for entering players' bodies. It's also vital in helping you save the girl, Rei. Rei Riku? Wait, do you know where she is? If so, then you've gotta tell me! She's in the hands of the totem's leader, the one they call Temujin. If you want to save her, I suggest when you two meet, don't believe anything he tells you. Instead, use Temujin. When you find your way into the Totem's headquarters, the Sausage Dragon will give you what you need to save Rei. It'll be our little secret, but don't you forget. The walls here have ears, so be careful. Soigen Riku, no matter what that man says, don't believe a word. Give me one good reason why I should trust what you say. <laughs> It's the beginning of the end. Let's move on, driver. Hey! I wasn't finished talking with you! Tell me where Temujin is! No need for you to worry. Even if you don't know where to look, I guarantee your paths will cross sooner than later. Huh? Incredible! Is that her true power? <laughs> You're awake! You okay, Farin? Are you hurt? Soigen, what just happened? Don't worry, the Collector's gone. Do you have any idea what she was after? While I'm not entirely certain, whoever's watching us might be able to shed some light on it. The real question is how long he's been tracking us. He must be why the Collector said the walls have ears. Hold on. I'm gonna take a closer look at his abilities. I told you not to let them spot you, but do you ever listen to me? No! The boss specifically told you to discreetly monitor them. How do you expect to do that standing in the open like this? No choice now but to kill them. Great idea, Kitakaze! Murder them and then collect intel! There's something very strange about that cube-shaped owl. Don't let your guard down. Whoever he is, he doesn't have a tomb weapon. But his power's the same level as Wild Wolf. Or possibly even stronger! What? No way! He's... he's one of the totems! Meaning he knows Temujin, not to mention... 
the place where they're holding Ray Riku. Wait, Soigen, don't go! Uh, the reckless idiot is running right towards us! We better make like a tree and get out of here! You're sure I'm not allowed to kill him? If you think so, you're dumber than the kid! Hurry up and move! Hey, hang on! You're not going until you tell me where Ray is! What was that move you just used? You managed to close the distance between us without much difficulty. Remember, Kitakaze, don't lose your cool over a persistent brat like him! You're one of the totems, right? Tell me what you know about Rei Riku. Nothing in my orders state that I have to answer you. <laughs> then I'm afraid I can't let you go anywhere until you do! What a fool this one is. Ah! What the? Please, Soigen. Surely you can move faster. I gotta try fighting this guy using some different technique or the battle isn't going to last much longer. Oh. Too slow. Damn it! Oh. His speed! I can't escape him! Xiao Shiva. Ah, uh, yes. I almost forgot about the other nuisance. Why did you... Are you just gonna stand there all day? If you can't win, then hurry up and run away! Now that you've got me worked up, I'm afraid I can't let either of you escape. You're no match for his speed. What was your first hit? This ain't gonna be easy. We're up against a high-ranking totem. True. So why'd you even rescue me? Well, uh, because as a member of your team, it wouldn't be right to just stand by and watch you die. Thanks, Farin. You're an official party member now, which means I look out for you, too. Here he comes. Unreal! His attack speed is off the charts! I can't even tell the number of times I've been hit! Damn! If I don't log off, there's no way I'll be able to reset my item's abilities! We're almost done here. Given the boss's interest in him, I would have thought he'd be more of a challenge. But no, this is disappointing. I'm bored. Let's get this over with and leave. Oh, what's this number on our hands? Does it have to do with the amount of times we were hit? I'm not positive. However, there could be some kind of magical effect tied with it. It's not just for decoration. There's only one way to be sure! You walked right into that, Soigen. Managed to dodge him. What's going on? The guy didn't even hit me! It's your turn. Gotta time this just right. <laughs> now I get it. If you get cut a certain number of times, then the game will force you to log off. You finally figured it out. But it won't do you any good now. <laughs> but I kept his last attack from striking me! <laughs> Dodge all you want, it doesn't make a difference! Disappear. <laughs> <sighs> Damn it. Who was that cheater? That forced logout is gonna keep me from signing in for a full 24 hours. Looks like Farin got the boot same as me. Hey, Farin. You too? Ah, so Farin is the name of your new girlfriend, Soigen Riku. Good to know. Who's this? Better yet, how did you get my name? None of that matters. But listen close and I'll tell you what does. Assuming you are interested in saving this woman, So you're the one who kidnapped Rei Riku. Who the hell is this? If you've heard her, I'm talking to a dead man. Oh, spare me the heroics, would you? If something were to happen to her, how would you stop it? That's the very reason we're keeping an eye on her. Miss Riku required our protection, though she keeps insisting on calling herself a hostage for some reason. <laughs> 
Where is she? <laughs> you really want to save her, don't you? Then listen closely. There's a festival being held on stage 18 of Gravebuster. You should attend. It's a celebration for players who completed every level in the game and a provision for conquering stage zero when the time comes. If you want to beat that level, which I know you do, you'll need to go to the festival. Once there, you'll have to locate a player named Nishikaze. Nishikaze? And how am I supposed to find a player I've never met before? Oh, you'll know when the time comes. Give me a straight answer! What's this got to do with getting Ray back? Say something! I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. He's the mysterious lone wolf who never says a word. The no-charge meister that showed up out of nowhere, defeating enemies with the lowest grade equipment. Geek! I was cool playing in Dungeon Century. I'm utterly useless now. Uh, <laughs> hey, Wanjoy! It feels like forever since I last saw you. So early. No! Huh. Looks like some kind of gathering. Guess there must be a celebrity on campus today. Has anyone told you how cute you are? You should totally join our cosplay club. So what school do you go to? I've never seen you around before. Please date me. Man, that poor girl. Swarmed over by a bunch of creeps who won't leave her alone. What social media platforms are you on? Can I get your email address? I'll take anything! I don't have one, all right? What? You gotta be kidding! You're not online! Do you even have a social life? Uh. What are you waiting for, Soigen? Are you just gonna stare all day or come down here and save me? Who's she talking to? It's that nerd, Soigen! Protect her honor! <laughs> don't get any ideas, pervert! Talk about him, I should've stayed in bed today. What the heck's going on? Who's that girl, and how does she know me? No. There's no way. But what if it is her? Farin. Okay, it is her. But that doesn't explain why she's at my school. I'm not prepared to deal with this. Plus, why'd she bring a suitcase? Makes me wonder, is she planning on staying at the dorm? Why am I being so awkward? Come on, Soyin, talk to her. What are you thinking about? What? Oh, nothing. Just uh, wondering how you found me, I guess. I work part-time as an instructor for the beginner's course, remember? So I was able to get some information on you. Obviously, you aren't happy to see me, so I'll stop wasting your time and go. Huh? No, I'm glad you're here and I get to see you in person. Oh, man. The worst part is every word I just said was true. But now she's here and I have zero idea what to say to her. Come to think of it, compared to reality, I'm a different person in game. Whenever I'm playing, I feel more confident and always know what to say. But real life's a different story. If I was invisible, would anyone notice I was missing? Sometimes it's like I don't even exist. Then you have someone like Farin. Exceptional in the game and real life. Check her out! Talk about my dream girl! I think she's new. A transfer student? At least I got it over with and she knows how lame I really am. Wonder what she's gonna say next. Excuse me, sir. Uh. You've been here an hour and only ordered water. Perhaps it's time you committed to ordering food? You do realize we have other students waiting to be seated. Sometime today'd be nice. More like any time this week. I'm starving. Over there. Isn't that the poor kid hogging that table and not ordering? Ah, give me that menu! May I get one to look at as well? Sure, here you go. Uh, so far in, what are you in the mood to eat? It all looks so delicious. One avocado salad, minestrone soup, the escargot, fried chicken wings, a teriyaki steak, squid tempura. She's bite-sized. How can she scarf down more food than she weighs? Her metabolism must be a miracle of science. No! More importantly, who's gonna pay for this mountain of food? The only money in my wallet right now. 
that's too embarrassing to mention. You're not just poor, Soyin. You are the king of being poor. All that money in the game, and it's absolutely useless in real life. If only I could pay for things with it. Chilled ham pizza, Alfredo pasta, oh, and the tiramisu. Should we dine in Dash? No, I won't start a life of crime over lunch. Ice cream and cheesecake. Okay, sir, if you would choose your form of payment. Uh, Before patrons get their food, they must pay in advance. No problem at all. No problem. I just agreed to eat here and I have no cash. Sorry. If that's not enough food, we can order more. You want to? More food? Oh, I couldn't. You see, I'm actually on a strict diet. My wallet's the one starving. I'm about to go bankrupt for one meal. What's a pool boy doing at a posh restaurant like this? You weren't expecting this young lady to foot the bill, were you, Soigen? Actually, weren't you going after Ray the other day? Looks like something changed your mind. Maybe her dad dying? Do I have to spell it out? Trash doesn't belong here. So why don't you give us your table? Apologize. What? I won't allow you to talk to my leader that way. Your leader? Soigen's in charge of our party in Gravebuster, and worth over a hundred million. So he's rich? <laughs> Uh, only when I'm in the game. <laughs> now that is hilarious! The little girl's a comedic genius! Hate to break it to you, honey, but this guy's a liar. Look, whatever he told you is crap. He wants to swindle you. It's not you. a lie! Oh, yeah? Prove it. Go right ahead and pay your bill using all those Shinro coins you claim to have. Huh? You can use Shinro coins in the game and real life? Sure. We accept that currency, as well as several other forms of e-money at this establishment. But how? I'll just need to scan your Seabay, sir. Uh, yeah, yeah, hurry up and get it over with. I want to prove this bastard's a con artist once and for all. Sir, for your payment. It went through? You sure your scanner isn't broken? I don't believe it. I can literally pull money out of the game and use it? This has never happened. There are so many zeros, the PDT can't display the full amount. You're not worthy! <laughs> I told you so. Soigen's a billion player. A female student. Inside the guy's dorms. Adorable. Damn his luck. How do you manage to score He's such a cute no no Objection! This goes against the handbook. What's up, Soigen? Ray's missing and you got a new girlfriend? Didn't waste any time. Shut up! I'm going to save her whatever the cost. Doesn't change the fact you're a two-timer! You heartless bastard! <laughs> this Ray people keep mentioning. Were you and her dating? We weren't. She wasn't my girlfriend. Then what did you mean when you said you were going to save her? It's kind of a long story. And part of me thinks I shouldn't even tell you since sharing it could put you in harm's way. I can tell you this much, though. Ray is being held somewhere inside of Grave Buster. I meant what I said back there on the stairs. I'm going to find her and bring her home no matter what. That's the entire reason I was so grateful you joined my party, Farin. Enough, Soigen! Like you said, we're on the same team, which means we help one another. Now let's go save your not-girlfriend. <laughs> Logging into Gravebuster. I know this place, but why are there so many people around here? <laughs> Quit spacing! The festival's starting! Festival? Just try and keep up. Um, sure. Hey, Farin, was this always a stage? Sure doesn't look like one. After the enemies are defeated and the stage is cleared, it belongs to the players. Then they're able to fix up buildings and level them up, open shops and restaurants, or use them any way they see fit. In short, it becomes a spot for the players to commune. This festival, that guy on the phone, 
He said something about this the other day. Everyone in the world knows about it. You see, the festival was created to prepare for conquering stage zero. Defeating the stage is a huge event, and there's no limit on a player's level to join in, meaning anyone can participate. So you're going to see a mix out there. You've got your newbies who want to test their luck, and also several elite players. In addition, there'll be a good number of people who are just curious sightseers, wanting to catch a glimpse of what the mythical Stage Zero looks like. Stage Zero. If you want to beat that level, which I know you do, you'll need to go to the festival. Once there, you'll have to locate a player named Nishikaze. Nishikaze? And how am I supposed to find a player I've never met before? Oh, you'll know when the time comes. So in other words, the totems are gonna be close by. I don't know what your relationship is with that group, but I really hope I don't need to remind you how dangerous getting near them can be. I don't know my role in this either. The only thing that I can do is keep following the clues and hope they lead me to wherever Ray is being held captive. I'm completely in the dark, unsure how powerful their organization is or even where they are. Why haven't you looked up information on the totems? Good question. I know. Since she's a guide for this world, she may be able to tell us something we don't know about their group. Master, it's been ages. How can I serve you? Tell me what you desire. Well, I guess my first impression of you wasn't too far off. You got the wrong idea, Farin. I swear, Twin Star's a powerful tomb beast. I hope you're not gonna demand too much out of me, Master. I'm still pretty exhausted after what you put me through last time. You really love going out of your way to embarrass me, don't you? So, what are you going to command me to do? You perv! This is not the way it sounds. We're friends, that's it. Only friends? But I've grown so fond of calling you Master. For real, she's a guide the system gave me to navigate the game. In your breath! And to think I respected you! Take a seat. I'll be right with you. Your stomach's a bottomless pit in the game as well. Players are psychologically connected to the virtual world, so yeah, I love eating equally as much in this reality. Also, your lack of sensitivity earlier depleted my HP considerably. <laughs> Wouldn't let me talk, then you clocked me. What do you think that did to my health? Hey, waiter! I want to order! I'm starving here! Wait. All you want is two bowls of instant ramen? Look at all the delicious food you can choose from. You have no idea how vital the existence of instant ramen is to poor students. It's our source of power. What do you mean by poor? Actually, I don't know how much you have, but it's got to be somewhere in the range of... <coughs> Chew your food. You hear the news? Another billion player appeared. Be serious. Everyone knows there's only five in the entire world. You're behind the times, pal. Word on the street is there's a sixth wandering around the game. You know, I did hear about some new player taking on both Precious and the Totems. Yeah, and a number of higher ranking players were also defeated. Crazy! <laughs> Wait, is that... It is! Unbelievable! Huh? Am I missing something? Sounds like they figured it out. What's my next course of action? Stand up, admit it, get the whole affair over with? <laughs> Let's see! Wait up! Those guys are sprinting over in our direction like they just saw the world's greatest player or something. I hate being the center of attention. The lifestyle never suited my temperament. But I can't be helped. Come on. It's a natural reaction once people discover I'm the latest billion player. I'm gonna be the first. But I noticed before any of you. I can't keep it a secret any longer. Whatever it is they're excited about, they're working themselves into a frenzy. Farin. You should hear this from me before someone else tells hey, you. Hey, boo! You're in our way, dumbass! Quit blocking the exit! What do you want to tell me? There's absolutely nothing between me and Twinstar! Did I punch you in the head too hard? Look! Over there! Sounds like something's happening outside. Is that a flock of flying penguins? I guess they're dropping prizes in honor of the festival. Pretty fancy. They look like rings. What do they do, though? They're transfer rings to stage 18. The final quest before you can proceed onward to stage zero. Apparently it's exclusive, which means first come, first serve. Then I hope I see some of you guys over on the other side. 
So then this was the reason behind the festivities. I hope the admins know what they're doing. Sure are a lot of participants for such a special event. The Godgrave Tech Company. I wonder what they're really up to. If the administrators are transferring that many players at once, it's probably not just a festival. You game? Could be a trap. Duh. If you're going, then I'll be right beside you. All right. Then here goes nothing. Everything is proceeding according to plan, Dark Tiger. All of the players are arriving via the transfer rings we provided them. Indeed. But like every stage before, there are still guards and a boss to contend with. I overheard they are forced to be reckoned with. How fortuitous we have a shield of pawns. After this level is cleared, the entrance to stage zero should open up. At first glance, it doesn't jump out at me as being dangerous. More importantly, I need to figure out how I'm going to locate Nishikaze among all these players. It's inconceivable the stage doesn't have any guards. You guys should go on ahead. I'll just hang back and keep an eye on things here. What's wrong? Here they come! I didn't expect the place to be crawling with this many Tomb Beast guards. How come there are so many enemies? I don't know, but if the players don't work together, no one will survive this battle. And it's only just begun. What an interesting assortment of items. I take it that's the portal to stage zero. But who are those two? If I had to guess, I'd say the one on the throne is Precious' leader, Dark Tiger. I didn't think he'd be here. Dark Tiger. I keep running into billion players. It won't do us any good to have our meat shields wiped out by the first wave. Speed things up. Whatever you wish shall be done, Dark Tiger. It's time we kick off the festivities in proper fashion. Steel activate! Stallion Saber! Centurion Buster! Whoa, what the hell is he doing? They defeated all the monsters in a single blow. Is that Precious's power? It's insane. Bushida, it's time. Yes, now that the weaker elements have been dispatched, he should awaken and the main event can finally begin. There's no more monsters to fight! Which means only the boss is left! And there's enough of us to clear the stage! No sweat! What the? That isn't good. <gasps> Why is it that color? Uh, this isn't a pool of red water. It's blood! Oh god! Watch out! Something's swarming out of it! What the heck is that? I'm getting the feeling he's not on our side. Yeah, Stage 18's boss! Aslan! Where is it? The blood I earned to go upon. So jealous. Looks like a lot of fun. Think I'll join them. You know our orders. Boss told us to wait here, Nishikaze. Don't do anything you weren't instructed. I don't need you to remind me. But you know how much I detest waiting. I'll go introduce myself. Ah! Maximum power and bring them down! Magic Mirror, Magic Mirror, grant my wish. Tell me where the final Tomb Guardian is. Look! The HP bar is replenishing! But he's missing an arm! How could it be filling up? That's unreal. This boss can use the Pool of Blood to regenerate any damage he receives. So you're Soigen Riku. Ah! Ah!
appears our data was right. You are the player they call Soiken Riku. That's one hell of a warm welcome you got there. Do you greet everyone the same way or just me? Don't let your guard down, Soiken. This girl's stronger than she looks. Yeah. I have a message. Even though my boss clearly instructed me not to approach you, I'm not one for following orders. I imagine if you've come this far, you're dying to see her again. Evil mirror manifest. A mirror? Now what? Who is she? Oh. That's Ray. You don't know how much I've missed you. <laughs> Ray! It's me! Soigen! If you hear me, give me a sign! Wherever you are, I'll rescue you! Are you close? Tell me where they're keeping you! If you're being held at the Totem's headquarters, I need you to tell me where it is! Ray! Can you hear me? Behind you! Ray, please. Don't worry. I'll find you. I know it's taken me a while, but I will get you out. And when I find the person who put you there, they're gonna regret it. Please, just hang on a little bit longer. We're gonna get you back home no matter what it costs. Poor Maki must be worried after I disappeared so suddenly. I haven't contacted the school either, so I definitely fell behind in my classes. And then I still have to sort through all of my father's belongings. None of that matters right now. First, let's worry how to break you out, Ray. Wait, do you even see me or hear anything I'm saying? Please don't go, Ray. Come back! Soigen? Is that you, Soigen? I'm right here on the other side of the mirror, Ray. We're on our way to save you! <gasps> Enough sentimentality. I hope you enjoyed your brief reunion. So you know, my boss also said you're quite the exceptional player, which I find hard to believe. It's time to see what you're made of. <laughs> Bring her back! Soigen! I'm okay, Farin. I assume this girl's niche Kaze. She's the one the guy on the phone told me to find. What a relief I found you. Tell me what your group is after. Why won't you let Ray go? You're a quick study, Soigen. Yes, I am niche Kaze. I apologize for attacking you, but I needed to test the strength of your divine tomb item. Hey, guys. Where'd the boss go? Not a clue. Has anyone ever fought one so overpowered? Stay sharp. We may not get far with what we have equipped. Yeah, I got it. Huh? None of your blood is what I stake. We don't stand a chance against him. Retreat! Save yourself! <laughs> How pathetic. I have no interest in weaklings like you, time to thin the herds. At least I can promise a show. With my summoning attack, your deaths will be spectacular. Slash Kai! Demons in the Sea of Blood, reveal yourselves! Guys, you see what I'm seeing? Those shapes. There's something alive in the blood, swimming right beneath our feet. Don't just stand there. Move into Formation D. I saw this in a horror movie before. And how did it end? They were so busy looking down, they didn't notice the real threat was coming from above them. But that was a movie! <laughs> what the hell is it? A blood-sucking freak! <laughs> These are my faithful servants, the Mosquito Legion. They'll bleed you dry. So if you want to live, I suggest you flee. Anyone unfortunate enough to get pierced by my minions will transform into a droplet of blood. Spheres of energy I absorb and then convert into bone. Now go, drain them for everything they're worth, so they may merge with me. Together we must protect the final tomb! Take a word for it! The damn festival was a trap! Despite such a generous harvest, the blood I seek continues to elude me. Where is it? Hmm. Someone's on that pillar. Their wave. 
It's so familiar. Then it is true. I've seen it for myself. That's Yuki Riku's wave. My boss sends a message. Since I've confirmed your buster item, proceed to stage zero as soon as possible. I'd love to, but I heard it was supposed to open five days from now. A rumor, nothing more. You can enter if you have the key. I can feel it waiting up ahead. The blood of the one I've long been searching for. I found you, Soig and Yuriku. What's he talking about? What the hell is this? We finally meet. You don't realize how long I've waited for this moment. Wait, for me? I was supposed to follow you, to fulfill the mission. Those were the orders given, and I intend to complete them. You lost me. First off, this is yours. The key is built to activate in response to your blood loan. Use it to enter state zero, chosen one. Once you arrive, your long dormant memories of the stage will finally be reawakened. But in order for that to happen, you must undergo one final challenge. What the? to present Aslan's ultimate form, Bloody Buddha. Up there, those players are gunners! Look it! There's something inside the boss's stomach! Soig and Riku, tell me if you recognize this. I, uh, would have to guess that's the boss's weak point? In other words, you remove the core, you defeat Aslan. You are correct. Pretty sharp for a one-eyed girl. But there's more to it than that. Before his death, Yuki Riku ordered Pada Soigen's memories be contained and sealed in the talisman you see before you. <laughs> of course that stupid weird geezer did. Just take my identity and stick it inside of some blood freak. I'm sure that it also holds your origins. If it simply contained your memories, I think Yuki would have told you before he passed. Uh-huh. Yeah, maybe he did, but without them, I've been having a hard time remembering things. Sorry, Aslan, but it looks like I'm going to have to ask for those back. They sort of belong to me. Be careful. Raven Scarf, I activate you. Upon summoning this tomb item, seven different gems appear, and every one possesses a unique ability. They randomly shuffle when activated. I keep forgetting which color does what. So please, choose me a winner. This one. The time has come. Show me the equipment's power. If it was worth him becoming a tomb item! Did you see that? It was some kind of explosion! A player must be fighting the boss! Do they have a death wish or something? Can you tell if Swagen's alright? It's up to fate to decide whether he'll live or perish. You're more difficult to kill than the rest. Unleash armed skill. The Raven Blade! I can endlessly regenerate any damage you deal my body! What good do you think a sword will serve you? Sorry to tell you, but this is no ordinary sword. In addition to its razor sharpness, the Raven Blade allows me to triple my speed. Opponents don't even have time to react. going to use the blood droplets to regenerate. Then, before he does... Aslan, I want my memory! <laughs> Not good. This armor's tougher than I thought. The blade isn't enough to pierce it. If I'm going to win this, I gotta come up with a plan B and quick. <laughs> you 
you immobilized me by damaging my limbs so I couldn't attack, then attempted to finish me off with a sword stab to the head. You must not understand, Sorgen Riku. As long as I'm in the ocean of blood, I remain invincible. Stab, slash, hack away as much as you wish. I'll heal and only become stronger! Interesting. Not only does it help you regenerate, you can use players' blood to gain limbs and increase your body size. Wait, does that mean that Ocelon is literally made from our blood, sweat, and tears? Yes. What's the matter, Soigen? Too petrified to make the first move. Guess it's up to me. Seriously? And he can shoot orbs of plasma? Not only did his size increase, apparently so did his power. There's no comparison. He's way stronger than I am. Can I even win against him? No, I don't stand a chance. Your precious sword is out of commission. Thanks, Soigen. At this point in the match, it's too hard to damage him directly. I can hold on a while longer if he doesn't have any other tricks up his sleeve. Huh? What the? Is that some kind of halo? Think of it as a crown. An emblem of those selected by me. This symbol is the mark of my snow lotus. The flower will gradually wilt over the course of the next 80 seconds. During that time, I will gain control of all the blood flowing through your veins. Once the final petal has fallen, the curse is completed. The blood will burst forth from your body and you will die! Burst out of my body?! <laughs> However, despite the odds of success, there's one chance to release you from the curse. If you're able to steal my core in the next 80 seconds, it will be lifted. If you win, you'll survive. But if you lose, your body will shatter. The same as your sword. In that case... No problem. That's plenty of time for me. 80 seconds is all I need to cut you down to size, Aslan. Why is that smoke pouring out of the sword? A defensive move? Whatever its purpose, the cloud is engulfing the players and the stage. It's becoming obvious the sword's true power isn't for slashing. Hey, what's up with the smoke screen? Is it just me, or do you feel like you're catching a second wind too? So you're a badass? Then stop wasting everyone's time and show us your ultimate move already. I'll oblige if you're that eager to die. What's he thinking? Doesn't he realize if he loses, the game permanently removes his assets? Seems confident. Maybe he's figured out something we haven't. Like maybe some way to defeat the boss and clear the stage. Very well. Since you desire to embrace death, I summon Bloody Hell Crimson Dragon! Upwards the serpent rises to the heavens, bringing about a storm that will seal your doom! The way that dragon's flying, swirling to the sky in a spiral pattern. Basically, operating the same as a tornado. Which means the closer I get to the center, the calmer the storm. It separated itself from Aslan. Valiant, but no use! He's not gonna be able to do this alone! Whoever he is, we gotta help him out! Go! <laughs> Pack of scavenging grave robbers. <laughs> We're moving around. Let's get <laughs> Strike to your heart's content. The result will be the same. Or did you forget I can regenerate? Not that I need to bother. Now that the dragon's completely immersed in the sky, you're in for a treat. Experience the wrath of my final attack, weaklings. Crimson Dragon Blast! Yeah.
Dad. You still refuse to die. It's of no consequence. You've disappointed me, Soigen Riku. At this rate, how do you expect to become a Tomb Guardian? You were too strong. There's no way I could have defended against your attack. Ha! <laughs> you freely admit to your failure. Just telling you the truth. In a head-to-head -head fight between the two of us, you'd always emerge victorious. Your move, Aslan. While you still have time before your 80 seconds expires, I can't stand to see the sight of a defeated would-be Tomb Guardian any longer! Soiken! The battle is over. Three, two, one, zero. Ah! What have you done? Soiken Riku! What did you do to me? You lost. It's finished, Aslan. My body. Why is it refusing to regenerate? Hey, I told you I wasn't lying. I knew I couldn't beat you head on after what you did to my blade. But this weapon came from my Gramps' Raven Scarf. So, there had to be more to it than meets the eye. I didn't realize what until after you shattered it. Wait, are you saying the smoke it released somehow gave you the upper hand? That vapor isn't smoke. It's highly concentrated oxygen that boosted Soigen and the other players' stamina. I figured out if the source of Aslan's power is blood, then his body must be composed almost entirely out of iron. I can't say it wasn't risky injecting his body full of oxygen since it would increase his power for a short while, but eventually it'd react with the iron and make him rust. Lucky for me, when the blade broke, it released even more into the environment. The sword itself must be composed of oxygen if it spread so quickly and engulfed the battlefield. Right! My Gramps' divine tomb weapon, the Raven Blade. I don't believe you. To reach the point where I couldn't regenerate, every blood cell in me would need to be affected. A valid point. Even with the hit Soigen did manage to land on Aslan, it still wouldn't have been enough. I mean, what other explanation is there? There is none. It's impossible. Why? If his sword was truly responsible, I would have started rusting as soon as I was damaged. And that clearly wasn't the case. You're keeping something from me. Some additional ability used while I was distracted. Nothing too remarkable, I'm afraid. As you said, I could only apply minimal damage with my sword strikes. Most of the cuts were superficial anyway. You could repeatedly heal yourself from any slash I inflicted, and only your blood splatter would turn to rust. Then I remembered something important. You mentioned you regenerate using the blood you harvest from players. So I created an oxygen field. That way all the droplets would be filled with the element. The more you kept regenerating to increase your strength, the weaker you actually became. That doesn't explain why my body dissolved. I should have still retained my form! Remember using your plasma attack? That's what gave me the idea. If I could convince you to use a more powerful move, then the whole field would be covered in an electromagnetic wave, resulting in the oxygen undergoing a chemical reaction into ozone. The blood inside of you soon began breaking apart, and your body followed suit. So all that ozone? It resulted in a second chemical reaction, which depleted your blood of the necessary oxygen. You're talking about oxygen poisoning. Yep. That's the reason your cells broke apart and became only liquid. It's gonna prove difficult for you to regenerate for a while. In the meantime, could you give me a lesson on how to use this thing? Journey to state zero and you'll receive your answer. Whoever he is, he's awesome. He defeated Aslan single-handedly. There's no way he's not a billion player. Sure it's looks like we showed up late to the party, huh, fellas? You wouldn't believe us if we told you. You guys see what kind of masks they're wearing? I don't believe this. Silverback! He's incredible. That's so odd. I had no idea there would be this many players remaining in the stage. No way that guy isn't loaded. What do you think about joining up with our party? Yo, I'm pretty certain that he's the guy. How annoying. You hear them? Everyone can't stop talking about you, Soigen. Let them gossip. The only thing I'm focused on is restoring my sealed memories. 
Speaking of, Aslan, what happens to you once your core is taken? That doesn't matter. You won, I lost. My job as a guardian has come to an end. As for how to use the core, if you follow me to State Zero's entrance, all will become clear. Before I go, there's something I've been meaning to ask you. Why hasn't another high-class player shown up yet? The only one who appeared was Dark Tiger, but besides him, not a single other major player participated. Don't you find that a little strange? The Mantis stalks the Cicada, unaware the Sparrow is behind it. This would be the perfect time for someone to steal my trophy. Very impressive. I was wondering when you'd notice. Ha! <laughs> You're an observant one. It's not that higher ranking players aren't on the stage. It's just that you can't see them. For your sake, I'm glad you didn't spend a minute longer defeating me. Or the one lying helpless in a pile would have been you. Meaning? Whatever you're trying to say doesn't make very much sense. <laughs> Unless there's some elite player hiding elsewhere in the level. If my suspicions prove correct, <gasps> there's only one place they could be. They're in another part of the level, busy killing each other. My thoughts exactly. The 10 million class players are logging off, one right after another. Wait, so the only reason they came here was to kill each other? How come they weren't interested in Aslan? Understand their motivation. The strong have confidence to spare. In their minds, Aslan was an enemy they could defeat any time they wanted. I see. <laughs> I bet they were busy fighting each other for a shot at the stage's boss. It probably wouldn't have mattered who won. I only know I was lucky to get the chance to challenge you before any of them got here. Or was this a trap set up by someone, Aslan? There must be more to this level. You have no oh. idea! Where'd they come from? Look at their masks! As you've already deduced, they're far from lightweights. Which meant I had to seek you out before they had a chance to fight me. If any of them had engaged me in combat before you, our meeting would have most likely never transpired. So basically, every high-class player on Stage 18 wants to get a piece of me. Guess we'll just have to cross that bridge after dealing with the core. We must hurry. Travel to Stage Zero. Then my mission will be complete. Shut whatever's left of your mouth! Oh. The hell kind of boss are you anyway? Letting this no-name loser demolish you! And you are? Address me as the Elder Baboon of Inbe. Hand over the core if you want to avoid a gruesome death. What? Are you sure? You certainly sound like a person to me, but if you want to be a monkey... Also, where's the rest of you? When you insult our leader, you insult us all! Silverbacks, unite! This isn't good. Those are the infamous gang of thugs, the Silverbacks. <laughs> Who do you call it, thugs? We're a reputable organization, and don't you forget it! Let's give them a demonstration of our three tenets. Teamwork, strength, and effectiveness! Yeah! I can definitely confirm whoever they are, they're not good guys. And I'm going to have to ask you to remove your foot. Aslan can't breathe with you. You can have that ridiculous mask and wear it for all I care, brat. You think just because you defeated him, you're suddenly worth a damn? When I tell you who I am, you'll crumble under the prestige. You should do yourself a favor and grow a brain. Bow while you still can. You, on the other hand, Honey Pie, I recommend distancing yourself from this noob as soon as possible. You should join the Silverbacks. I could take special care of every part of you. <laughs> My ID is Ryuman. Feel free to contact me the moment you change your mind. Listen up, Skullheads! Proclaim our motto, loud and clear! These plebes obviously need educating on the rules of the game! Yes, sir! Silverbacks! You can't beat us, so you best log out! Silverbacks! Retaliate against society! <laughs> well, terrifying, aren't we? Now hand over the core already! If there's one thing I can't stand, it's raving morons like you. Farin, hold Aslan for me. <sighs> That's weird. You feel warm and look even redder than usual. <clears throat> Seems like I've got no choice. I have to fight you before I... <clears throat> A surprise attack? How cheap can you get? My bad. I was just a hair off. Cheater! That was way overpowered! You think? Tell you what, since you're so cute, how about I show you an even stronger one? 
No way! You see that coin he's got? A one million Shinro coin! Think he's gonna spend all of it to enhance his items? Wow. Didn't know you could upgrade your weapons with money. Hey, you bankrupt bastard! Bankrupt? Why'd you say that? You think you're fooling anyone with your t-shirt and jeans? You're as broke as they come! The only reason you beat the boss was because you got lucky! Hope you enjoyed it while it lasted, since it's about to run out! You never laid eyes on one of these before? Consider it an honor! Only players with assets of a million or over can access these graphs! You mean the Beam of Light represents his assets? That's a real warrior! Based on its intimidating length, you can clearly make out my total assets reach beyond the five million mark! That's it? I don't know if I'd go bragging about it. Don't pretend like you've seen bigger! How about it, Silverbacks? Should we show this dumbass our asset graphs? Yeah! Silverbacks! You can't beat us, so you best log out! Silverbacks! I never thought they'd have so many million players in their party. And they aren't afraid to show it off. Huh? You think ours are big? Wait until you see our leader's assets. His exceed well over a hundred million. If you like doing this so much, mind if I try? Oh, by the way, how do you use an asset graph? This scrub doesn't even know how to access the graph? Do yourself a favor and hand over the fruit before you end up hurting yourself. Uh, asset graph up here? What the hell? Elder, sir! You haven't seen anything that big! So, how's it measure? It's stupidly long! Under thousand, a million, ten million, a hundred... Anyone still doubt he's a billion player? No wonder the dude was able to completely destroy the boss like it was nothing at all. You certain you want to take the core from me now? All this time, to think he was a billion player... Stop acting like this is some damn miracle! I don't know how the chief is gonna take this, though. Huh? Not good. <laughs> all right, I know we've all been having fun, but it's time to get serious. Evil Mirror, come to me. Amazing. <laughs> about whiplash so this is the entrance to stage zero we should be able to get in with no problem thanks to the key we got earlier you're the only one that can enter the stage the rest of us will have to wait here until you return is that a fact whatever lies just beyond the gate was meant for your eyes and your eyes alone so again got it i'll see you guys when i get back you won't go in the load uh, hold up you mean you can fly All right, here it goes. Some kind of white void without sound. Nostalgia's washing over me. It's time, Soigen Riku. Consume my core. Your repressed memories of this place will return, and my mission will reach its conclusion. Well, bottoms up. <laughs> uh, what is this? And the ceremony is nearly finished. What ceremony? Ugh. Ugh, damn it! There goes my status symbol! Huh? Who's calling me at a time like this? Yeah, what is it? I'm a little busy, so whatever the hell you need, just cut right to the chase! It's me, idiot. Or don't you recognize my voice? Ah! Please, please forgive my insubordination! I've got all the time in the world! How can I help? I just finished off this small fry. 
but maybe you could shed some light on a mystery. Seems someone already defeated the Guardian boss. So then, who's stolen my rightful victory away from me? What am I seeing? Are, are these my memories? Who's that girl in there, Gramps? Someone very special. The same extraordinary power that flows through both of us resides within this child as well. The poor girl's parents were murdered by him. Despite his efforts, even he cannot stop the ceremony. Her powers will be offered to this tomb. The process is nearly complete now. The only step remaining is for the tree to entirely absorb her essence. And in exchange, her power will then defend this tomb. Unfortunately, she must have no recollection of her former life. She'll grow up to be a normal girl, freed from the chaotic fate she was once doomed to. Hey! She fell down! Zeugen! Hey, do you need some help? Who are you? Why? Oh, right. My name is Soigen. Hi, Soigen. Hi. What should I call you? You have a name, right? Uh, huh? She fell asleep again. Grandpa, why is it that she can't stay awake? Poor girl has lost her strength from the ceremony. Will she be okay? There's nothing to worry about, Soigen. Actually, it's your turn next. My turn? I'm sorry I have to do this. Understand, I must take every precaution to ensure the enemy doesn't find you. Huh? As of now, you are no longer my grandson. <coughs> what? Uh, Aslan, did I really just see my memories? Correct. He was convinced it was the best way to keep you safe from danger. He saved your memories and information about State Zero within that fruit, waiting until your return. Powers residing deep within this ancient blood, hear me and heed my bidding. Using this fruit, protect the tomb from intruders. Arise, be born from a sea of blood. These are your orders from the 157th Grave Guardian leader, Yuki Riku. Arise, so I may bestow upon you a form and title. Aslan, remember the following. Those two precious children are the single advantage that we have in this struggle. I task you with an important mission. Reawaken Soigen's memories when the time comes. Now do you see who you really are? Yeah, I'm remembering everything. Excellent. Then my mission has reached its conclusion. Aslan. I have one final gift for you. A gift? The entirety of my powers I transfer to you! What? Ah! Are you seeing how many coins you just Looks won? Looks like every player that survived the battle is receiving prize money! Lucky me! Glad I showed up! I never thought I'd accumulate so many Shinro coins! Grave Buster is the best! <laughs> My Sibe just got a notification. Aslan was defeated! Which means Soigen should be coming back. A little early for celebrating. <laughs> Finishing off the boss in a stage too quickly can sometimes backfire on you. What the hell's going on? Well, you see, it turns out we're kind of no match for this player, boss. Really? I assume you didn't fail to mention my assets or connections with Precious? I don't think that would have changed anything. Spit it out! He's not like the others! This one's a billion player! What? Did you say a billion player? Please don't get emotional until I can confirm it, boss. Let me look into it more. No, I only want to know his location. Uh, well... Hurry it up! Right, uh, his current location is on top of the temple at the transfer entrance for stage zero. Not for long. Hey, Elder, what do you think the boss has got in mind for him? I don't know, but man, is he pissed off. Speaking of piss, BRB. Ha! Like I ought to give a damn if he's a billion player or not. Rich, poor, my Artemis Knight treats everyone the same way. Map Cannon! How's it too early to celebrate? 
There are certain players who don't think highly of those who defeat a boss before them. Case in point, a powerful energy beam is headed right for us. Hey, you see that? Whatever it is, it's bright! Could it be a UFO? Or a shooting star? Victory fireworks? None of the above, I'm afraid. Looks to me like a super long-range wide-area sniper shot. Based on these readings, its power is immeasurable! <gasps> we won't be able to dodge it in time! <laughs> what a beautiful sight! It's not often you get to see the boss use his god-killing shot! Map Cannon's his ultimate special move that he can only activate if there's over a thousand players on a stage! The perfect solution for clearing the board of pests! <laughs> we let our guard down for a second! Both of you, stay back. Damn! This is absolute madness! No way any of them are walking away! Are you alright? How'd you stop it? Looks like your wardrobe got a much-needed upgrade. Thanks. That's not the only thing I left with. A god-killing move had zero effect on this dude! But that's impossible! So, what did I miss? Are you sure you're not hurt? That wasn't some minor attack you should be able to brush off. I'm fine, Farin, thanks to this new equipment of mine. I'm guessing that stuff's your reward for defeating Aslan. Yep, the bloody armor. And apparently, having it fully loaded also raises my HP. When it goes into effect, my health increases until it's equal to the combined total of every player on the stage with me. What's still pretty amazing, though? That attack depleted it by nearly a fifth. Don't get too cocky. Most of the HP came from the one who fired the shot. <sighs> so glorious. What beautiful destruction. Who's calling me? Whatever it is, make it snappy. I'm enjoying my work. Huh? What? You're telling me my god-killing attack had no effect? An interesting turn of events. Very interesting. I'm headed your way right now. I can't remember the last time my heart was beating this fast in anticipation for a killing spree. What's your email? Do you want to be my friend? I can't help but feel sorry for them. All the players here were simply pawns. The entire point of the battle was to use their numbers to lower their collective attack power, making it far easier to wipe out all the low-level players simultaneously. But anyway, now the festival's over. I think it's time you met my superior. All right, but first, I want to see Ray with your mirror. And I want to speak with her directly. Whatever. Lucky for you, I'm feeling generous. It's you! Do bear in mind. Withholding certain information from her may keep her safe. She doesn't know about the earlier battle or stage zero. <sighs> Sweden, you really came back for me. Of course, I'd never forget you. Ray, the whole situation is complicated, but I'll explain everything when we meet. I understand, and I look forward to hearing all about it when we see each other again. Soon, and that's a promise. Just a little while longer. A few days at most. Please believe me. Afterwards, everything will return to normal. I know. I believe in you. Do you remember how I waited for you exactly like this on the last day of Dungeon Century? I know you'll save me, same as before. I'll never let anything like this happen to you again. I swear that I'll protect you, Ray and find who's responsible for killing your father. I'll be waiting right here for you. And look, I've got upgraded equipment now. Ray, see you soon. Sweden, wait! That's enough for now. <sighs> Stage zero will officially open in five days time. If all goes as planned, I'll hand you over to Soy Genriku. That is, if he manages to stay alive until then. I hate to tell you this, but you already know what I'm going to say. Yeah. It looks like I'm gonna have to defeat anyone who tries to conquer Stage Zero. Then we can agree due to circumstances we share a common enemy. If it means saving Ray, then so be it. I'll do whatever needs to be done. I'll protect Stage Zero and Ray Riku. The 
preparations for my dominance over stage zero are now complete. Go and see that it is done. Dark Tiger, my lord. I do have one concern about this plan, and I'd be remiss not to address it. Mm. The player responsible for defeating Ocelon was far stronger than we could have ever anticipated. Stronger? Are you trying to say someone besides that primate was able to clear the level? They engaged the boss faster than the Silverbacks. And now that the treasure was won by another player, their leader is seeking revenge. So he's gone rogue? Who does he think he is ignoring our guild's rules? Order him back! We won't permit him to... But Dark Tiger, sir... For quite a while, Rondon Gyoku's been desiring to earn a Lone Star title. That's right. Then I believe it's about time he finally achieved his due. Let's go. We're done here, and my boss wants to make your acquaintance. Me too. Right. Uh, what the? Where'd that explosion come from? Who the hell just fired into a crowd of people? Don't you have any manners? Look, someone's coming out of the smoke! <laughs> well, that was a reckless move. Whoever's responsible for stealing my quarry, take a step forward. I want to look the thief in the eyes before I kill them. I'm gonna take a wild guess he's the leader of those silverback guys. Soigen Riku, don't delay. Let's go. You know, I think that I should let you in on a little secret. Huh? It's about Ray. She's on the other side. Then let's go. <laughs> Hurry up and reveal yourself. Otherwise, I might be forced to kill everyone until I find the guilty party. And you wouldn't want that, would you? Damn! That's one of the Echelon of Precious! He must be Rondon Gyoku! Crap! Everyone run! <laughs> A strengthening technique? We don't stand a chance. Are you insane? If you don't know who you're looking for, what's the point of attacking every player? Don't you have any common sense? <laughs> what is this common sense? The only thing that makes sense is, if I'm having fun, it must be right. He's completely unhinged. The transfer gate has been opened, and I'm going to head back to the fortress. Are you coming, or do you plan on remaining here? Wake up! Did we journey this far to rescue Ray or fight with some lunatic? We can't wait around! Just like everyone else, the world's crawling with guys like you who are all bark and no bite. Now then, where's the pile of garbage that stole my victory and what will be left of them when I'm finished? Just ignore him. Let's get going. <laughs> Soigen, I won't ever stop believing in you. I knew you would never turn your back. <gasps> hey, what about saving Ray, you idiot? Sorry. Please, hold on just a little longer, Ray. Predictable. He's like a moth drawn to a flame. <laughs> At this range, I really wouldn't be surprised if my attack murdered you in the game and real life. You have my condolences. survive this time. The bloody armor must have spared my life. Whoever this guy is, he's no joke. Isn't that player one of the totems? Stay out of the way. This is between me and him for what's rightfully mine. Hey, are you listening to me? 
What's your story? First you try killing us, then at the last minute you have a change of heart? His real name is Purple, codename Kitakaze. He's one of Totem's eight Imperial Guards. As you've already witnessed, he's an expert in the use of swords, but also... What do you think you're doing? Don't take another step closer to Soigen! <sighs> Are you... healing? Oh, all the HP I lost from those two attacks is suddenly returning to me. That was a whole lot of damage. There aren't many ways in the game that allow you to replenish health, with the exceptions of medicinal herbs or grave beasts with healing skills. The third option is you're lucky enough to know one of the few people with the title Doctor like Purple. I heard when it comes to the rare titles like yours, not even a hundred players have managed to reach that level yet. <laughs> <laughs> to think I showed up just to defeat a lowly boss! And shocker, I find you all waiting instead! Life is full of surprises, isn't it? Now then, I have business with the boy, so if you'd kindly step aside... I'm more than enough to deal with you. You'll have to get through me. Some weakling from the totems? Not interested. Do you actually think you're worth even a second of my time? You move as fast as you talk. Well, if that's more your speed, why didn't you say so? <laughs> Just as boring as I expected! This freak show is keeping pace with me. Your dexterity is surprisingly low, my friend! And your strength is basically zero! How do you expect to damage me when you're both slow and weak? Huh? It increased. For some reason, his attacks are causing the number on my hand to gradually rise in value. I'll look forward to you actually doing something interesting! Armed move! Tempest Punisher! <laughs> what a major shockwave! He's got an array of destructive attacks. And avoiding them is difficult. <laughs> Armed move! Tempest Arrow! Damn it. Looks like my number hasn't gone up at all. So whenever he makes contact with something dealing with me, like armor or a weapon, the digits increase. And when they reach a certain point, something bad probably happens. I sincerely hope it wasn't that cheap of a trick. But seeing how you're not able to even lay a finger on me, I'm afraid it'll just have to be a mystery forever, won't it? Huh? What are you doing here? The boss gave the order for me and Nanda to drop in and rescue you, sorry lad. And it appears we arrived in the nick of time. Well, looks like we've got an ice wizard joining in the battle. Pretty rare. Shoke, how about breaking apart that wall when you've got a minute? Ah! I don't know what the hell's going on, but I can't move! Ah! Ah! At last, I can finally enjoy a moment of peace and solitude. I suggest you two settle down and come enjoy a cup of relaxing tea with me. Who the hell are you anyway? Well, that won't do at all. Someone get over here and help my timing! Well, well. And we also have tree binding. A variety of summoning magic on display today. We're happy to show you more. Or you could be smart and give up. <laughs> me give up? Even among Precious's other elite members, my abilities are vastly superior. My assets total at 999,999,999. In other words, I'm a billion player in all but name. Are you positive you want to allow this, Dark Tiger? Not to speak out of turn, sir, but remember Rondon Yoku did attempt to steal your throne at one point. What do you say? Let's have some fun! Strengthening move! Satan! Can't be serious. There goes the peace and solitude out the door. What is this? He's more powerful than Aslan. If you're really the sixth billion player, let's see if you're as deserving of the rank as I am. If you're really the sixth billion player, let's see if you're as deserving of the rank as I am. He grew. The things on his back are transforming. <laughs> How much stronger can he get? Armored move! The Rikudo Rene Cannon! 
This puppy shoots 666 shots in one minute. In short, aiming's not really a priority. Everyone, get behind me. Such an irrational display of force. My ice shield isn't going to hold out for that much longer. Hurry out of his range and find shelter. There's no safe place to run. What do we do? Oh, come on. At least put up a struggle. This is it. I'm sorry, but I've reached my limit. Halo skill. Penta sunk wood. Activate. Oh, so you're trying to soften the blow by surrounding yourself with Mother Nature, are you? I give you a 10 for effort, but I wonder how long it can withstand my barrage! <laughs> hey, we're not dead! If we wait here long enough, do you think there's a chance you'll eventually run out of bullets? No, the wall will not hold. But it did buy us a moment. Hey, Mr. Billion Player, if you got ideas, now's the time! Before we act, I need to know something. Considering this guy's assets, wouldn't he become a billion player if he defeated one more Grave Beast? I mean, what's holding him back? What an incredibly stupid question. I can provide an answer, but first... The name is Beck, and it's a pleasure to meet you, Soygen. You too, Beck. I appreciate it. Once your assets near a billion, they reach a cap. From then, you're unable to accrue more. It doesn't matter how much you strengthen your buster item, or how many beasts you defeat, your assets remain frozen under a billion. In total, there are ten players who are nearing or are currently at this critical point. Every one of them has the potential to ascend to the Billion Player status at any time. And included among this small group is Rondon Gyoku, one of Precious's senior members. He reached his own critical point during the first year of Gravebusters closed testing. But despite everything he's tried, he can't reach a billion. In order to break past the asset limit, you have to earn a Lone Star grade title. I see. Interesting. Then I must have obtained Lone Star at the same time I received my sea bay from Gramps. Can someone trade titles with another player? Not that I know of. A title is basically your occupation within the game. But Lone Star operates by different rules. Players typically receive their titles through a combination of experience and performance. In addition, you can achieve rarer classes by completing difficult side quests. In my case, I brewed over 10,000 healing potions, which earned me the title of Doctor. Nondead's title is Element Master, one of the 10 legendary levels. He had to master metal, wood, water, fire, and earth magic. An extremely difficult feat. There's a list you may consult to find how to earn a specific rank, but Lone Star is the only title without any information. <laughs> I should have had the Lone Star title long ago. Today it's mine! One year later, Dark Tiger. I'm getting tired of the silent treatment. Don't you think it's about time you told me how to obtain what I so rightfully deserve? Even after I ended up killing over a hundred high-level players, it didn't make any difference! So what? Maybe I've been going about it the wrong way. Perhaps I should kill a billion player with a Lone Star and then I'll take their title. Don't try and grow a brain now. You wouldn't last a single minute, monkey boy. Listen, I just want to know if there's room for advancement in this guild. What do you say, boss? Let's pretend I somehow got the opportunity to challenge one of the billion players. You wouldn't be cruel and stop me, right? Lone Star titles are unique. No two are the same. Furthermore, each has a tremendous corresponding power. Powers so influential, they can break the rules of the game. They can subvert the game's rules? That makes sense. Like how the Collector can hold ten items. I wonder, what does Grave Guardian let me do? Huh? Seems the enemy has ceased his firing. Who wants to take a peek outside? I'll find out what's going on. Don't do anything reckless out there. Hold on! Just a little longer, Shoke! I'll get these vines off of you! Boss's Rikado Rine cannon needs recharging! We gotta wait three minutes for it to cool down! Afterwards, it'll be able to shoot six times stronger! Hope they enjoy these next few minutes because they're gonna be their last! Even a billion player can't withstand the hellfire I'm about to rain down!
You mean to tell us you don't even know what special abilities are associated with your title? I got the basics down, but it didn't exactly come with instructions. Fortunately, I've got a plan. What do you intend to do? Our enemy is rather unpredictable. Hey, unpredictable I can manage. I just need to see him with my own two eyes. That's your big plan? Raven Scarf, activate! I imagine Soigen is probably fighting about now. I wish I was by his side. I'm sorry I'm not there. Please don't lose. <laughs> your three minutes is up! Energy recharge is now complete! Oh, billion player, I hope you're ready for the final round! <laughs> First, I think I'll do away with this distraction! Stand in my way, little girl, and you'll get buried! His Gatling gun's more powerful than before! Everyone, stand back! I mean, there won't be anything left of them after that, but in the end, that doesn't matter, does it? Since I've killed a billion player, the Lone Star title belongs to me! Ah, Chief's a legend! He totally obliterated that rich boy! Sorry, did you actually think you won? That'd be difficult seeing how he didn't log out. What's this noise? That explains why I didn't see any game messages congratulating me. How did we dodge his attack? Yeah, good question. I admit I didn't see what you did back there, Soigen Riku. But I feel that you were responsible. Care to explain? I'd be happy to. The Raven Scarf can only select one jewel at a time. On this occasion, it chose the Purple Gem, which in turn allows me to strengthen one part of my body. Saturn. Now, all I have to do is look at you and your stats become visible to me. Saturn takes this information and then analyzes the data. Sure, but you can't save anyone just by strengthening your eyes, which means the jewel must have enhanced some additional aspect of you that relates to movement. If I had to guess, what was really strengthened was right at your feet, your shadow. That's right. Saturn uses the light reflected in my eyes to supply me with strategic knowledge, then makes my shadow explode, granting me the ability to travel in various directions simultaneously. You listening, you oversized freak? You can't win! <laughs> you just don't know when to give up. I expected nothing less from a billion player! But I'm Rondon Gyoku, one of Precious's VIP, so don't underestimate me either! See those bullets on the ground? Surprise! They're really bombs! Let's go out together! You've already lost. Why don't you accept defeat? There would be a lot more dignity in it. You idiot! What's the purpose of living if you're not willing to die fighting? If you enjoy combat that much, then I'll make you an offer you'll find difficult to turn down. So how about it? Care to go one-on-one -on -one with my boss, Temujin? Temujin? <laughs> hmm. Well, that seems to have gotten his attention. Leader of the Totems and one of the only six billion players. While killing you would bring me great satisfaction. If I defeat Timujin, not only do I become a billion player, I'll inherit the role as boss over his group! If this is Totem's base, there's a good chance Ray's behind these doors, too. Temujin, we're coming for you. <laughs>